Whoa, okay. Hello, Cyber. Hello, thank you for the lurk. <laughs> hello, hello. About to cook some dinner? Awesome. Be back later. Bwah! Okay. You enjoy your lurk? I'm here, uh, getting ready. <laughs> and by getting ready, it's mostly just refilling my water, making sure the coffee's good, and putting out the link. Alright, I'm gonna continue doing that. All right. Okay, it's time. Okay, bring you winter. Hello, 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 hello. What? <laughs> How are you doing, huh? Might have morning voice. I'm uh, I'm streaming you earlier than normal. I had a very productive morning and got everything out of the way, and so I'm streaming early. And also, I'm full of energy to stream early. Okay, so we could be working on my new conglomerate. Although, 
Anu is always fun. Sorry, I had to toss the pan. <laughs> Hanky. How are you doing, Twangy Winter? Why was the chat so... Oh my gosh, it does this every time. I'm gonna fill chat. There we go. Chat is filled. Chat is no longer so small, okay? So. I don't know which faction to play. I'm kind of thinking I focus... I, in, I really enjoy these three. This is the lowest level of them all. I should probably be focusing on it because this faction is a bit more dynamic. It it joins whichever one of these factions has the least uh, population. So if I if I selected NSO NS operative as a freelance, it would probably join Banu right now. All right. I've been inflated. You've been inflated. How's it feel, huh? You like that? <laughs> okay, calm down. Uh, but yeah, I'm good. How are you? I'm great. Woke up energetic. Uh, slept in. Uh, yeah, I slept in. Woke up energetic. Uh, was productive and everything. Got everything out of the way. Now I'm here. We can do things. I'm here early. I'm full of energy. Earlier than normal. Usually I'm like energetic towards the later part of the day. Like around 8 to 10 p.m. Eastern is when I'm really bushy-tailed. <laughs> I love it. Fuck you, Biden. <laughs> what, you don't like being inflated by Biden? I'll inflate you and just be biding my time. It's true. Alright, anyway. I'm going to start with NSO. Biden is anti-inflation. Oh, he deflates you. I see. I can't believe you. <laughs> you know, hmm. Yes, Biden deflates you, making you small and flat. Did you know that? Oh my gosh. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna get on. Um oh goodness. I'm gonna have my sip of morning coffee. This is my first coffee, okay? That's what you get for a, an early stream. Mmm. Wonderful. It's a Krispy Kreme medium, uh, classic medium roast with a lot of whole milk in it. Almost like a flat white, except it's not an espresso. I may have to turn some settings down just a bit. Yeah, maybe things like that and render distance. It could be toned down a little bit. Ultra? Nah, it can be high. Oh, uh, those will take effect upon restarting. Alright. You know what? I'm down to restart then. Because that was... You, you could tell that was pretty uh hard on... You could tell it's, it's kind of hard on my system. So. Milk drinker? It's true! Listen, listen, I'm the only milk drinker here and we have a whole gallon in the fridge and I have four days to go through it. I'm, I'm, I'm a, I'm a heavy duty milk drinker right now, Melly. Anyway. Uh, what was I going to do? Oh yes, restart. Yeah, we'll restart. Don't worry. It's coming back. Where? 
喂。I made eggs this morning. Oh, well, you know what, Reba? I made eggs. It's <laughs> it's Pepsi and eggs. No, I didn't make that. I didn't make that. I need to re-log. One thing I will say about the client of Plant Side 2 is that for the past nine months, if you type in to remember your login, it can actually break the client and just hard lock you out of the servers until you re uh, reinstall. You made pegs? You pegged someone? I mean, uh, if you're asking. I am on the verge of panic. I am panicking. Why? I'm beginning to worry. Why are you beginning to worry, Melly? Oh my goodness. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Reba, for the tier uh, five tier one community subs. Very generous of you. Going to Catwitch53, Nimmy Plays, Spartan Fan 007, Patriot Mom 45, and Twangy Winter 6. Thank you so much for bringing me these lovely subs for pegging. Peg a break, good times. Okay, okay. We we need to calm down now. My mother watches streams sometimes. Oh, the game's coming back. Where it's back. <clears throat> Goodness, the milk drinking might ha might have my voice a bit rough too. You might you might have noticed. You'll probably continue to notice. I'd rather drink the milk than let it go to waste. Pega break sounds like you don't want to calm down. Anyway, we're going back in. Hopefully this isn't as intense on my system. That was really lagging it down. Anyway. You won't notice the difference either way. By the way, uh, just before I started stream, I had my first round of uh, Halo Infinite multiplayer on PC. And I it, it, it went wonderfully. It went quite wonderfully. Did you notice? I actually posted it in the games channel of the Discord. I got, uh, I only shot a sniper rifle in a 12v12 battle. I got four kills, uh, so I carefully placed my shots. Four kills, three of them were headshots, and I got what? What was it? Three assists and only one death. It was, it was pretty fun. What are you? You're unmarked. What kind of goon are you? Why is it? Why was that guy unmarked? Like you can see the names and tags over everyone here. That guy was just a nameless goon. What? All right, one moment. I need to fix something. <coughs> oh, I'm so sorry for coughing in the mic. So, do you want me in normal outfit or maid outfit? Is it is it is it normal or maid outfit kind of day? Calling strangers goons. How rude. <laughs> Look at this goon. <laughs> oh my. Maid or normal. Maid or thigh high Thursday? Are you saying maid? You're saying maid, aren't you? You're saying maid. Okay, I'm still trying to fix it. Hold on. Yes! <laughs> I 
Oh yes, welcome Selu. How are you doing? How's your morning today? I hope it's well. Okay. There we go. My day is all right. I've just been super bored and lonely. So happy to see you streaming. Aww. I definitely understand the bored and lonely feeling. Hopefully we are here to keep you company. Make sure you don't feel so bored and lonely. And I'm actually happy to be streaming early today. Maybe it's just me relishing in the fact that I want more time with y'all because I leave in four days for California for one to two months. And I know I will miss y'all if I can't get into a stream. I will certainly miss this method of streaming. You know, the, just normal streaming and stuff, not on a phone or anything. Because it's very likely that streams will be, uh, be on a phone. And or I might be hanging out in the Discord a lot. Yes, yes, keep me company. I shall lock you all in a cage and keep you But then I can't go to Cali. Then I can't go surfing again. Oh, yeah. Mourn our brother. Our fallen comrade. He had a heart attack in the base. Didn't even get to leave. Oh, wait. We get to see what the day's missions are. What's the daily? A bounty hunter, obviously. Pushing back, heavy assault, reconnaissance, infiltrator, yes! Okay, and combat medic. Hmm. All right, so we already have infiltrator. Yep, this seems to be our weapon then. Oh, right. That's right. We bought a new... Uh, last stream, we bought a new rifle. A, a scout rifle, which is an automatic uh, mid-range weapon. It does retain accuracy and stuff, as long as you don't move too much. So, that's why it's a scout rifle and not just called some sort of assault rifle or anything. So, yes, this is our weapon now. Let's see if we can moder uh, modify it more. Um, apparently the for I hear the forward grip doesn't do much for you. You don't need to go to California. Just come to Indiana and keep me company instead. I live by a lake. All the people I know IRL live like 30 minutes away and refuse to drive down to see me ever. Aww. You know what? I know that feeling because I, uh, here in Chattanooga, all my friends are in Atlanta and it's a hard time, um, get, uh, getting like meetups and stuff, you know? I think don't need hip fire reduction. Oh, increases the hip fire cone of fire by 20%. Let's get a compensator. Oh, it makes you show on the minimap 35 meters farther away. Okay, a flash suppressor makes the shooter less visible to the enemy. I like the idea of that as an infiltrator. There we go. Yes, get that on there. You can actually see it added to the barrel at the end. Boop. Cool. And we have that equipped, right? Okay, I actually resupplied and now you can see it right on the tip. Cool. 
That's a recent update, actually. I refuse to drive, period. I'll take a train, though. You know what? I'm really happy that there's, like, train availability around California. I wish there were train availability here. There's some because of the Chattanooga Choo Choo, but uh, it's limited and reduced to the point where the Chattanooga Choo Choo is a tourist attraction rather than very functional. Like you're on that passenger, on the passenger cars for tourism reasons, unfortunately. I wouldn't mind them not wanting to come here. But they never come this way. And I drive up there on a daily basis for work, and then there are days when I will get where I will get home and then turn around and go see them. So I make that drive twice a day. Oh heck. Oh, it's this place. We're starting with this, huh? Quite a strong start. That's a first kill instantly. Ooh! Unfortunately, he had a buddy. Otherwise, I think I would've won that 1v1. Oh well. We revived, and that fight was inconsequential. Whoa. Boom. There are tanks here, so I'm actually scared. To start firing that way. Oh, I got sniped. What is that? A Mako? The Advantix Mako sniper rifle embodies the long distance stopping power of a traditional bolt action while retaining versatility through a balanced reload speed and attachment variety. Ooh. Are there any medics around? Yes, I certainly know that feeling. I don't know the feeling about, like, being there twice a day and We're still having a hard time getting people to meet. Um, I just have a hard time getting there. <laughs> that gun is massive? Yes, the guns in this game are pretty massive. I mean, mine is too. It's just that you're seeing down the barrel so you don't notice so much. This is a massive gun. It's pretty beefy. There's still a guy here. Yes, there is. He caught a little bit of my face there. That dink sound you heard was someone getting a headshot on me. I mean, mine is too. <laughs> my brain immediately went 18 plus for a moment. That's a headshot. I think I'm holding down this uh, area pretty decently, decently well. Did you see that shimmer? That shimmer totally gave him away. Damn. Don't worry, it doesn't have to be your mind, though. I mean, mine is too. Okay, I gotta stop. I, I gotta stop. I 
actually need to recharge my shield. Excuse me? And then they sli <laughs> they slink off. What? What was that interaction? Ow! Ow! Damn. This might be too long range for the, uh, the mode to be effective. I might go back for the... Hmm. Let's see. Yes, I think I think I will go back for the more traditional sniper rifle. Let's see what happens. This is a massive gun too, by the way. Like it not even not even just length, but you can actually see it has width to it. It has like huge rails on the side. This is a heavy sniper rifle. Oh, I missed. Partially because the uh, the guns of this faction are particularly massive because they are expected to be held by droids with hydraulics and stuff, not humans with muscles. I saw you. I missed. Damn it. And you? Oh my god, can I hit him? No! <laughs> Oh, come on! What's happening here? Why, why is there just... Oh, wait. Damn. It takes three shots from these semi-autos. Ooh! I couldn't follow that one up. Nah, you know what? I like the Tamo. We're going back to the Tamo, and I'm gonna try a different position. Let's see what other spots there are. Ba, ba, ba. So this goes out onto the uh, side railings that you were seeing. Now we can have a bit of a two fort fight. If you remember two fort from TF2, this is going to be a very similar fight. No one there? Okay. Damn. I'm not doing so well. I'm not doing so great. Oh my god, this person has the officer hat and everything. What's our mission progress anyway? Um ah, oh, it's a it's a ways away. It's a bit off. Oh, that's a max suit. Never mind.
Where'd he go? Oh my gosh, there's sniper there's other cloaked snipers everywhere. Oh, I got him. I don't know if that was the last bullet or the grenade, but I got him. Oh, no. Come on. Is there a medic? Give me, give me a medic. Give me a medic. Is there a medic nearby? There is no medic nearby. Okay. Oh, we lost the facility? So we did. We'll have to spawn in behind. Hey, yeah, well. Alright, so it's south. The base is south. Whoa, wait a second. That's so cool. You made the log the entrance for a player made base here. And there's walls all around. Oh my god. Look at you. I love the updates that they've done to base building that allows us to, like, have this as the exit and entry to a, a player base. Um, screw that battle. I want to go back inside and just take a look here. Bit of a limitation right here, but you can, you can definitely hold that. That's so cool. You're controlling that rocket way over there? Hey. Look at this place. I... The community never ceases to amaze me with its player bases. I hope the fight comes over here so we can see this base in action, you know? I never knew there were player bases in Planet Side 2. Oh yeah, and they actually re had a somewhat recent update. I say recent. I mean, in a 10 year old game, recent in this sense is like, it's been, it's about a year old, year and a half year old update. Um. Oh, that's an enemy. I did not get it out to fight that. Uh, they did some updates that allow special uh, things over bases. And also allow com um, commanders to ha uh, spawn big capital ships and uh, level 100, rank 150 plus uh, accounts can actually um, add some special things to aid in fights. And the, uh, that sounds like a really high requirement, but they're everywhere. Lots of veteran players in this game. Uh, so. You'll see all sorts of new deployables in this game, and there's been a strong focus on increasing player-made bases. And that's how you get cool stuff like this. Anyway, thank you for the hydrate. <sighs> I appreciate it. All right, we're going to that uh, back to this area. We've got recaptured the um, this big fortress from the uh, Terran Republic. Huh? Maybe I should revisit sometime. But I still hate playing alone, so, so I'd probably download it and then not play. I honestly like to play this game alone, even though I'm in a squad. And yes, you do get like participation bonuses, cohesion bonuses, they call it, I think for playing around uh, around in the vicinity of your squad and contributing to like reviving them, healing them, resupplying for them. Oh. 
Oh, I just barely missed that last bullet. Ugh. Anyway, I like playing this game alone because it's a really nice game to, uh, to... It's honestly the most chill shooter to just wake up to and enjoy. This is actually... For a few years now, it's been my morning coffee wake-up game. Um, because you can just drop in, drop out whenever you want. So you don't have to wait for any matchmaking or stay for the duration of a match and maybe get salty about it. And there's no one really to call you out and say, hey, you're doing terribly or any or any sort of that toxicity. Because you are one in 200 in a battle. So it's fun. It's really fun to get that shooter itch out without feeling like you might be weighing down a team or something. Anyway. Oh, I need to pace my talking. Goodness. Or else this early stream will also be a short stream. <laughs> Alright, let's get up. Oh, that's an orbital strike? I don't think so. Oh, this guy died. How the heck is this one room holding? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, global chat. Which room? Kind of battlefront desk then? Maybe, but there's no start and end to any fight in this game. Really. So, uh, like, the battle here, when the continent locks in about an hour and a half, it'll open a new continent, and these same people will go into that new continent and continue. So, just 24-7 battles that's gone on for years. You know? Battlefront has some matchmaking to it, and... There's a limit to how big the lobbies can be, unlike this. And there... Well, I say that, but when the game gets, like, really heated, like, there's been a post on the Reddit or something that calls on a faction to help defend, um, you can get queue timers to join in. Uh, just just to help slow down the load Other than that though, um, there's largely no limit Also, those battles have a start and an end. Was I cloaked or not? I don't remember. Anyway, it doesn't matter. For revive. Oh, it's one of these hallway fights. Hey, I killed someone with my grenade. I was concussed, but I killed someone. Darn. Oh, you're there too? Someone, please revive. That's a sweet suit of armor. That's a sweet, like, Warhammer suit of armor. Someone, please? Anyone? Melly, how are you doing today, sweetie?
All right, we're going to take an airdrop this time. Oh, God. No, I just airdropped. How could you? And you don't even have a face. Why don't you have a face? Hi, I'm Melly. Hello, I just got shot by a headless horseman. Woman. What? <laughs> oh, another AirPod there? Oh, that's cool. Alright, let's try not to die so quick. Oh man, you saw me? Fuck. Um, anyway, I'm okay, just working and trying to mod Minecraft. Don't tell my boss. I am. No, I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm kidding. Unless? I don't know. I can't believe you're trying to mod Minecraft. The true best boss. <laughs> Hacky. I can see that Melly is submissive and possible. I wish I could watch streams at work. Aw. Same. In you in youth we learning age we understand. What? What what was that name? And what was it saying? I have to help customers though. Boo. Same with me on the phone. Oh my god, a helicopter. The equivalent of a helicopter. A mosquito. Damn it. I'm doing terribly. Let's look at our score. 4 and 10. Ah! 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 I don't, yay, I just, I, I just talk to angry, overworked doctors and nurses. Oh, I see. I see, I see. By the way, uh, last night, I did a big upload of, uh, of VODs and pretty much caught up the VOD channel with the Twitch channel. So it's up to my latest stream. All right. So if you ever want to see some older VODs, you can go to the VOD channel. Oh, thank you, Melly. You're quick on the draw. <laughs> anyway. We drop in, and there's not a huge truck, not a huge thunderer there. Don't worry about it. Wolf girl looking for owner. Likes head pat scritches, treats. Dislikes authority and haters. That's enough reading for me today. <laughs> what is the global chat right now? Excuse me? I saw someone, and they had a bounty. I want that bounty. I want that damn bounty. I want- mm, Give me that bounty. You dislike authority, Melly, but you call me your boss? Give that wolf girl my discord. Damn. Okay, this thing with the multiple, like, inaccurate shots, it might not be suited for such a tight range to engage someone with.
well. Um, damn. You are now the fire team leader. Big mistake. I shouldn't be the uh, fire team leader. Why don't you make this guy the uh, fire team leader? The Come big D bag. Do you see him? Not like I'm planning to usurp you. <laughs> Not like I'm planning to usurp you and do. Oh, role reversal. No gods, no kings. Oh, that's a headshot. And you're still not dead. And you're still not dead. You just wiped everyone. You're still not dead. You finally died. What was that guy on? I want what he's having. What? Heck. Only cute princes? Heck yeah. Thank you. Those are grenades. Oh, I killed someone. That's a grenade. I'm okay. What? <laughs> Why am I okay? I stared the grenade in the face as it exploded on me. Oh, I somehow killed someone with a headshot while I'm flashbanged. Thank you for the healing. Never mind. <laughs> That's a grenade. Oh! Yes! Give me- No! Come on, get me up. Get me up, get me up, get me up, get me up, get me up. Medic, 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 medic. Yes? Oh, thank you. And that's a flashbang. <laughs> no! Who? What? Oh my god, there's someone with a knife just right here. You're kidding me. The power of flashback. Those are grenades. Never mind. Thank you, Skitterbug. What a mess. All right, get those motion detection bonuses. Yes. You just keep dying over and over. Ah, oh, that's the that's the magic of some of these hallway fights. I'm just gonna give support by give uh, shooting out motion detectors. All right, my good sir. That's a grenade. I can repair that. I'll get you fixed. Wah, 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 wah. I don't know if you can hear it over the uh, sounds of war, but wah. More smoke. Hotbox the tunnel. Yes, hotbox us. Mmm, yes, you like crossfading like this, don't you? We all like that. G give me more flashbang. 10 out of 10, Wes. What? More flashbangs, more smoke, more hotboxing. Mmm, you can smell these Girl Scout cookie uh, brownies in here. Mmm. Yes. Where's the edibles? This is a party. Just, you don't, you can't even see them. Just fire away. Just keep firing. It's okay. <laughs> Where are my fucking Thin Mints? Also, hi, DJ. Yes, hello, DJ. 420 still isn't legal in Indiana? Damn. Wait, did I? Wait, I rejected the uh, revive, didn't I? Damn. 
Someone else try? I don't think they can. What? Give me out! <laughs> Give me out! Where am I? <laughs> Help me! <laughs> no! Oh. Okay. I'm out. <laughs> I aced my exam. I have my driver's license for semi trucks. It's official. Good job, DJ. We're all proud of you. I hope you enjoy your adventures of driving semi trucks. all the people here. You know what? What if I went around? There's another entrance somewhere around here. No! Anyway. Congrats, DJ. Hypers! Heck yeah. Don't mind the screams. You, you were warned. Oh my gosh, Melly gifted a tier one sub to DJ Stuki. Thank you so much, DJ. Enjoy the month. Thank you so much for the generosity, Melly. A sub for you, big boss. Oh wow, Melly, thanks a lot. Heck yeah. I wonder if I can sneak around again. Have another go at this. Oh, can I get a kill from that? Yes! Oh, that was a bounty! What? That was a bounty! I got the bounty! How many people did I kill? The names are still scrolling. Okay. Here we go. I need to kill one more and then detect motion of nine more people and then hack some turrets. The Salu! Oh my god! Welcome. Zaylu, thank you so much for a thousand biddies! Oh my gosh! So generous! Ah! So kind, so sweet, all of you. So much. You all mean so much to me. It... It... Ah! I'm so happy you would choose to give your love and support to these, uh, to this, this little, this little streaming boy. Oh my gosh, DJ, party time. I'm off tomorrow. Ooh, you going to a party? I hope you have a good one. You deserve it. Thank you so much for the cheering 200, DJ. You're so generous too. Oh wait, a hype train is close? Wait a second. I see. Wow, you took a full clip to the face, buddy. Oh. Res me, res me, res me, res me. Yes! Yes! Okay, now. And you know what? I'm going to do squad spawn. Here, squad spawn. Oh! Oh, that's bad timing. No, they destroyed it! Did you see that guy come up to my beacon and destroy it with a knife? That bitch! Someone res me. Thank you. Oh my god. Wait. Melly, thank you for gifting another community sub. Bob Hawk Sangha, I hope you enjoy your one month courtesy of our very 
own lovely mod and sword holder Melly. I'm about to get nuked. Hey, I lived. And Sailor, thank you again for another 1,000. I'm gonna die. One moment. <laughs> thank you so much for another ten dollars. Oh my gosh, a thousand biddies. Why? Why my bids didn't cover the high train? Actually, I'm pretty sure yours did, didn't they? Why isn't it starting? Hey now. Twitch? Twitch, you're bugged. Why isn't that starting? Hmm? I was just testing something. Your bits did count, my sub didn't. Oh. It's not started. Yeah, why hasn't it started, Twitch, huh? This guy's just looking over me. What? Come on, Twitch. You're being weird. And not in a goofy way. Oh, we're, I, I spawned just right here. Well, get some motion detection bonus. Can I get a kill? Grenade? Oh, no. I may have assisted the killing of some teammates. Skitterbug, thank you for the revive. DJ, thank you so much for a gifted tier one sub for Aspie. Aspie VR, who regularly raids. I hope you enjoy your sub. It seems like it only does that for you. I'll need to uh, get your settings. Huh. Or maybe because I'm a, mo a mod, Sag. What the heck is going on here? How how much is that, Twitch? Like that's one thousand bits, two hundred bits, a gifted community sub, another thousand bits, and another gifted community sub, and you're not in a hype train mode. Wait, one sub, two sub, three. That's three community subs. One uh twenty two hundred bits. I'll take my new license and I'll drive that train. I like that spirit, DJ. That's good I'd spirit. Like it needs fight. three persons. Oh, it needs three persons? But that's... Oh. Thelu, thank you. Oh my gosh. You're so giving and kind. We're three. Everyone else was gifting subs. I had to join in. Thank you so much. Foster31345. I hope you enjoy your lovely community sub, courtesy of Salu. <laughs> Goodness. But Plant Side 2 doesn't have cute cat boys. Not with that attitude. Shame. What's happening here? Oh, did we take over this hallway? Wait, we took over this hallway. We took over the reds. Those darn reds. Oh, whoa, what happened? Here we go. An anonymous gifter is giving a tier one sub to my community. Thank you so much, anonymous. Oh, was it you, DJ? <laughs> Who was that? You don't, you can remain anonymous if you want. But Luco. Uh, look up now. Enjoy your sub, courtesy of Anon. Ever seen the Vanu announcer in person? Uh, we don't know he's not a cat boy. The Vanu announcer sounds like he's 147. I hope he's not a cat boy. What? Petition to have cat ear cosmetics? What's happening in the global chat right now? It was me. Since it didn't see my name, it worked. That's so goofed and stuffed. I, that's goofed. Yes. That's done goofed. 
but thank you so much, Melly. You're dead. Never mind, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm so bad at the 1v1s with this rifle. It's not meant for right. It's not meant for 1v1s. It's meant for. Woo! This rifle. Oh, I still need to kill one and then hack three terminals. This rifle is meant for ambushes and assassinations. It's not meant for 1v1s. Unless, wait, would you consider an assassination a 1v1? But where, like, the, uh, but the target doesn't know they're in a 1v1 yet. Or ever. Wait, is that, wait, would you call an assassination a 1v1? Tell me. <laughs> I guess it's up to the uh, philosophy and what happens in the assassination. You know? I would. You would call an assassination a 1v1. It's a sudden, unscheduled 1v1. Pretty homophobic Twitch, TBH. Anonymous is very popular. I see them on every channel. Oh, I see. <laughs> right? I see them everywhere, too. Crazy. Anon is everywhere. Only if I'm an- only if I'm the assassin. Alright, where's this fight progressing? Outside. Oh my god! You don't see me! Why are there bodies everywhere? Who's- Who's fighting where? Where is the fight? Oh my god! You don't see me! You don't see me! No! You don't see me! They're gone. Oh my god. A stretch? Okay, Salu, I will stretch shortly. Where is everything? Ah! Okay. It's time for the stretch. <laughs> hmm. I just want to be assassinated with cuddles and love. Ah, oh, yes, loving assassination. Oh my god! Melly! Oh my god! This. Ah! Melly gifted tier one, uh, five tier one subs to the community. You've gifted a total of 30 subs in the channel. Screaming Angry Wombat, Speaker A, uh, Sayun, let's see, Garnalt, and Sticky Za. Enjoy your subs. Enjoy one month subscription, courtesy of Melly. Whoa, what's happened? You- wait, you got it all the way to a le- We're getting to a level four? Hype- it is a hype train. But does that mean I get a hype emote? I mean, I have hang time. I have hang time emotes. They- oh! Oh my god! And that's it to 100%? It's beyond level 4. 100%. Oh my god. Thalu. 10 tier 1 subs to my community. Thank you so much, Thalu. You're all so generous. Oh my god. Level 5. 90% to level 5. Fox of the Fox Dragon. Uh, Bulls X2. Uh, Felagato. Ebby Sam, Eggpon God, Time Space, Pyro, Shiza the Trickster, uh, the Azure Hood, Itzy and Bitsy. I hope you all enjoy your one month subscriptions courtesy of Salu. Oh, and Melly gives nine, 90 biddies contributing towards the level 5 hype train. Thank you so much, Melly. 120 from DJ. Trying to get 100% on level 5. Thank you so much for the contribution. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Another thousand biddies? 
Full. Oh my god. Hype. That is super hype. Oh my goodness. Uh, the bleh. <laughs> I. Oh gosh. I. I don't know what to say. The world blew up. As if to celebrate all of you getting it to 131% of level 5 hype train. Thank you so much. Thank you, everyone. This boy deserves it. Aw, oh, shucks. What did I do to deserve it? Gosh, y'all are awesome. It's still going. The alert is still going. My god. I don't really know what hype train stuff does, but it seems good. I don't need a party. The party's right here now. Yeah, it is. Who knew? Oh my god. <laughs> yes, it is a sweet victory. So, Selu, what hype train does is... Um, it can give exclusive emotes, not for just uh, uh, exclusive emotes for just about any channel. So now you can, you should be able to uh, use those for a while, just around about around oh, anywhere, you've got this. if I remember correctly. Um, but it also, the higher level hype trains uh, actually give impressions. You have hy hype emotes, yes. Uh, but it can actually increase the impressions of the channel and the stream. It uh, it can sort of boost me in the algorithm if I get hype trained on the higher levels. So more, uh, it can bring more impressions to uh, the people. It recommends your stream to 500 people at level five. Oh gosh. More likely to be on the front page. Oh, yes, let's boost this good boy. Ah! Y'all. <laughs> oh, goodness, y'all make me so happy. I swear. Y'all fill me with joy. More. Oh, boy. Okay, so. Should we continue in this fight or go to another one? Um, is there even another one to be at? No, all the action is still right here. We have almost a hunt. We have anywhere between 50 and 100 allies versus over 100 enemies. This is a party too. All right. We just need to get to it. And besides, we still have to kill one person and then hack three terminals. Let's try to get that one last kill. My score is awful. I'm going to go and get a delicious, delicious Dr. Pepper. I shall be back. Ooh. Bring me one too. Dr. Pepper's great. Hype train complete at level five. Your community contributed a total of 19 gift subs and 22, 2,220 bits. Thank you so much. All of you. One moment. There we go. I'd actually like to and I'm going to paste it. There. Choo-choo. Yes. We get to ride the hype choo-choo train. Take a ride on the Chattanooga choo-choo. Ah, I, I need to remember the song. Oh, fly? I'm gonna... No, I'm gonna kill you. Sailor, thank you for giving out another community sub. Lintu Freaky, enjoy your one-month subscription. Last one. 
Thank you. I have no idea where the action is anymore. That's a grenade. Oh, that's the headshot. That's the kill. We get out of here. Okay. Nice rock music, too. I don't know how well the uh, stream picks it up with my volume levels. But yes, I think we're going to uh, hack three enemy terminals or turrets. And then we're going to uh, go to the next game. Since this is an early stream, I hope for it to be a longer one, too. You know? So, I, uh, again, I did put it up in the air in Discord whether y'all wanted the next game to be Elden Ring. Um, let's see, Elden Ring, Rimworld, Tropico 6, or what was the last one? What was that last one? Elden Ring, Rimworld, Tropico, or Guild Wars? Yes. Which one would y'all like for the next game? Huh? Oh, an amp station? Perfect. Wait, that's not mine. The Terran Republic has taken the facility. I'd like to see more Tropico. Hold on, pull time. Okay. Alright, so we know Sailu wants more Tropico. I also know that DJ has been convinced to get Tropico and play through them. Though so I have a feeling. Oh my god. Gob still running cough edits, I see. What is happening? What is happening in global chat here? Wolf girl looking for outfit. Oh, yes, that. Go back to the latex fetishists from Banu. Time to leave Nason's. Gob's still full of cough edits, I see. You're No, you're just bad. Still running a train on your mom, I see. What's happening? The global chat is such a fucking mess. I have Tropico 4, 5, and 6. Honestly, those are the best ones. When they really hit their stride and kept... Because, like, they keep building on each other. The only real um, risk taker... I shouldn't say that. But the only real disconnected uh, game from the rest of them is Tropico 2, that. where it go focuses on pirates. The rest keep building on the previous generation's Tropico. You know? So... Yeah, I would say the later ones are actually the best. Did you get number five or number... Oh, I see. Please vote, nerds. We got Tropico. Tropico it is. I actually really like this gun. Anyway. Um, it's time for flight. I need to set a waypoint first. Let's go to this amp station. Personal waypoint. Does it show on the map? It does. Okay. A dervish. What is this? Is This is new. You know what? Sure. For the hell of it, let's take a dervish. Oh, whoa. Okay. Okay, it flies like a helicopter. I see. Can it go any faster? Yes, it has an afterburner. Oh my god. Oh, I'm bad at 
I'm bad at helicopters in this game. I'm good at helicopters in battle uh, battlefields, not these. Or at least I used to be. I was really good with flight in a. Uh, I was really good with vehicles in general in Battlefield 2. I don't know about new ones. Just doing anything? I'm just strafing. You know what? Sure, let's let's full strafe. Oh god. Does it mean we all have our maps and we can trade together? That uh what's the multiplayer part? I'm not too sure. I haven't tried it out yet. I don't know either. I'm not familiar with it at all. Hopefully there's no one here. I get to just uh, drop in peacefully. Uh... No! No! That- Aw, oh, that killed me. I was- I came in too fast. Okay, let's try it again. Keeping the waypoint. Going back. Okay, note to self, slow down. <laughs> slow down before exiting. There are no parachutes. That guy died. Are we in Portsy's Discord? I'm there. We should schedule something and try it. Heck yeah, you should. All right, let's let's be in first person this time. Oh, that actually honestly increases like the feeling of control being first person. Can I pull up? Okay. I almost hit that. There's an enemy. Let's hope they don't notice me. Let's actually go low for it. Yeah, so they don't notice. You jump off a plane and you're surprised you died? Maybe. Maybe. Maybe I'm surprised I died with all this futuristic stuff. Maybe I was hoping it would kind of beam me down. Okay, that didn't work. That didn't work. Oh my god, I'm sick. Okay. That didn't work. I thought I was being fancy. I was not. I am not in a Millennium Falcon. Anyway. That'll work. You can see some uh, terminals in various places. But what I'm interested in are some turrets around the outer perimeter. You can uh, hack these and it counts. Plane and trees and rocks. Portsy, come on. <laughs> it's fine. It'll work. It always works. All right, you see that blue 100% bar on the uh, on the mini map over there? Uh, that means that actually detects me. That shows the percentage uh, balance of like the factions on the map right now. So you can see that since this is enemy territory and it shows blue and I am of the blue faction right now, there's no one here. This is perfectly safe.
I'm like Sheldon Cooper, I don't get sarcasm. Usually I don't either. I could deal sarcasm, but not always get it. Especially if it's British sarcasm. British sarcasm is so sarcastic that it sounds like they're just talking to you in regular sentences. That's the one. All right, let's let's claim our rewards. First, the bounty hunter, that very lucky bounty hunter one. What was that from? A grenade? I killed someone with a grenade. And then reconnaissance for killing with a sniper. Okay. I like English humor, humor better than American humor. Don't forget I'm French Canadian. English sarcasms are hard to get for me. Right. I understand that. Ah, so now it's time to seek out Tropico. It's time for my PC to freeze up for a moment. There we go. I usually, I do usually understand sarcasm, but I like to pretend I don't. And then people try to explain, explain it to me and I laugh. Epically gaslights friends. Oh, by the way. Oh, wait. Trains 3 was recently added? I remember when it was uh, coming soon. I didn't know it came out already. Damn. I won't have really enough time before the trip to, like, explore that. I wanted, I wanted to try it. Yeah, at some point when I get back, if I'm still into stream, probably will be. All right. Probably definitely will be. That's loud. It's it's hard it's hard to play single player games without without streaming, you know? Oh right. Tropico. There we go. Now whenever I come back you might see a train simulation. I'm just saying. Lurk BRB. Also, that's not what gaslighting is. Don't do that. You know, this is the perfect music to have a rum to. You know? This music makes me miss my black spiced rum. I still haven't done a drunk stream. Okay, you know what? When I come back, I'm getting my favorite black spice drum, no matter what it takes. Even though it's hard for me to acquire here, we'll have a drunk stream. It's always a party in Tropico. It never stops. <laughs> Okay, I'm getting wine to celebrate. Okay. Load, load our glorious June 1955 island with 36% public support. <sighs> it occurs to me that this uh, splash here, this loading screen is actually the island we currently are using. You can see the connection of islands around here, where we built the bridge, and then oh, the postcard built this same bridge. Do you see that? That postcard. It, it's like focused around this angle. It built the same bridge. And y'all were talking to me like I was crazy. 
sort of. Not really. I'm kidding. But like you were, <laughs> y'all were like, why do we have so many bridges? The postcard built the bridge too. Did you see that? Okay, I have three of them. They had one. Still though, vindication. Still crazy though. What do you mean? You wouldn't enjoy a huge bridge over the ocean like this in a tropical island? Connecting two tropical islands? How badass is that? Look at this guy. He just gets to sail boats. You know, just under these huge bridges and enjoy this awesomeness. And this is just a part of their everyday life. I got I got foreign aid. I have received foreign aid. Look at the money we get. That's every time someone rests. All right, we have low unemployment. How many vacant jobs? Only seven vacant jobs. So one more immigrant ship. Something like that. <laughs> We're expecting an export of 12,000. What happened here? Rubble, rebuild it. What are you doing? Rebuild and quick build. This is a form of significant revenue for us. Look at this. The Crocodile Ranch is $19,000 in production. Look at this one. $22,000. What about this one? $15,000. And look at this. I can increase upkeep but efficiency by 10%. Yes. Give me. Give me that. Give me those crocodile hides for the tannery. What do you mean the production value is zero? You produce hides, right? No, you produce leather. Where do we get the hides? Oh, we see these days. Okay, hey, what if we changed resource then? Meat, leather, wool, milk, meat and hides. Now nah, keep it on crocodiles then. Oh well. That just means we demolished this. All right, what can we do with this then? We have a new space. Presidente, the workers have a request. They wish not to work. Right. Not clinically, but those boats look so small compared to the bridges. Isn't it cool? They just get this epic scale to go past. I am afraid of heights, so the only bridge I enjoy is the of the Jeff variety. Jeff? Anyway, he's handsome. <laughs> What? What are you talking about, Melly? You silly. You goof. You goofball. Do we have the furniture factory yet? If we do, it's somewhere like this. The mansion hasn't made money. All right, can't uh, demolish it then. And since we have 41% approval, overall happiness 56 though, pretty nice. Liberty, pretty decent. It's actually going up recently. Jobs, job happiness going up, good. Housing happiness shot way up. You can see three years ago from when I uh, electrified houses. 
fun going way up. People are actually enjoying the art district now. Wonderful. Healthcare happiness is still the highest at 66. We might want to keep that higher. Deaths by starvation, zero. Alright, I, I like these numbers here. So we're going to save, let this number recover. Alright, and politics. Who is what? We mostly have militarists. No wonder. We're a pacifist state and we have militarists. And so that's why our support keeps going lower in this new age. We also have mostly industrialists. I see. Mostly capitalists, militarists, and industrialists. Oh, goodness. And the Western powers are liking us. If that's the case. And I still don't see the uh, furniture factory. Let's put the furniture factory in the uh, tannery place, tannery's place. So what's the... Okay, we do get meat, corn, fish, milk, shellfish. We do get a wide variety of food for our people. And do you work a $6 wage? You know what? Let's do a $7 minimum wage for grocers across everything. There you go. Increases job quality a good bit. Because it is a decent employer. And increases the food quality, hopefully. It increases food happiness. Although... Hmm... Oh well, never mind. Maybe we could produce more fish though. Do you emit pollution? It emits pollution, but this doesn't. And it requires four high school students. Okay. You know what? If no one wanted a mansion here, then that's on them. We're going to put a fish farm here. You only have one passenger. You know what? No, cancel that construction because we want these people. Ah, darn. Okay, now our lowest count here is job happiness. Only four unemployed people with five vacant jobs across the entire place. So I want to get immigration office. Let's do Tropico first to keep that under control for now. Back, welcome back. And go full speed ahead into the next year. Oh, yes. 
you need. Right. So where's our emissary? Oh my god, that's making so much money. Kind of makes me want to make a copy of the newspaper. Didn't I make a radio station sometime? Oh, there's a furniture factory. Why isn't it getting planks? Alright, well, if that one doesn't have enough supply... Let's add two positions? I don't know. Yeah, add two positions. I think we need more logging here. Like maybe two more logging camps here with a lumber mill nearby. Like right by it. Let's invest in another Teamsters office. There's a lot going on for just one Teamster building and a port. So how's the embassy doing? I can't request I uh, aid. Okay. There we go. $40,000 from an export freighter. Well, if that's the case, build the Teamster's office. Build the logging camps. And then I want the lumber mill. And then this will help us produce more planks for the furniture, uh, furniture factory. What else could we do? Public services. I do want to research the hospital. TV station. Didn't I build the radio station? Where is it? It looks like this. You can already see the circle of one. Oh, here. Yes. And what do you have? Open mind? Ooh, music all day. Increases the service quality of all entertainment buildings. Ooh, the entertainment district is in range. By five. This bonus does not stack. Bet. Music all day. Thank you. Now what? Slightly increases the approval of citizens employed in the vicinity of the radio station every time they work. Ooh. Decreases liberty by 30. You know what? That could be pretty good. Support is back up to 54%, by the way. Since I'm increasing some industry. You earn, H you earn $8 for each citizen employed in the vicinity every time they work. That's a public service advertisement. I see. Citizens employed in the vicinity of the radio station have a chance of 25% to shift their political views toward the environmentalist faction. 
I see. Well, let's do public service advertisement. See what happens. I actually want to see watch this number. Oh. Look at this shootout. This is shooting up so quickly. All right, well, this is making 100 to 260 a month now. Look at it. It's already paid itself off. Well, actually, it's it's already become positive and staying positive. How's homelessness? Decent. All right, we have a full tenement here, so you know what? I think it's time for another tenement. Ooh. Maybe not. Let's actually look at homelessness. It's all broke people? Wait, you're all retired. I'm not taking care of my retired people? I see. Do I have an edict for this? Social Security, retirees and adult students receive 60% of the average wage paid on Tropico. And what is that? What's the average wage? Can I see this? We have 44 uneducated vacant jobs really we need more edu uneducated people at this point are you saying that the high school is too effective because i can defund it look at this well up is actually rapidly expanding this is only over three years think about that filthy rich is staying the same rich is staying the same but well off is rapidly expanding, poor is decreasing. And Caneview said that he would not operate, he would not live in one of my places, huh? Believe it? Anyway, let's defund this a little bit. Make it, yeah, 90% efficient. rich? How are you filthy rich? No idea. Alright, this thing is... Yeah, increase efficiency by 10%. Uh, it requires an additional 50 megawatts of power. I'm tempted. I don't know if the power plant can handle it. It's at full budget. Uh, with a positive balance of only 40. Yeah, we can't afford that right now. Unless there are more vacant homes. What's the vacant uh, housing? 30? Okay, this tenement, mostly empty. Destroy it then. And what about this? Oh, just... Just one for each of these? Okay. Alright, that's fine. So, what is this? Capitalist standing decreases by 12. Oh, We are mostly... We do have a mostly capitalist demographic.
this is already making thousands. That's insane. Anyway. Ooh, another freighter for 25,000. Thank you very much. Media and education. How about... Hmm, an inspiring statue. That's actually new. Nuclear program. Phase program. All right. Uh, TV program? TV station? Increases liberty nearby. Broadcasts propaganda affecting uh, citizens living nearby. Especially effective on children and retired people. Well, let's decrease your pollution by 25%. And maybe build another one? So that I'm not so held, held back here. Seems like a good idea. Because then I can get into more types of transportation, like metros. Because metros can actually... Um, yeah, passengers must be at least four. Uh, metros help you get from island to island without needing the bridges. It's more direct. I think my biggest complaint with Tropico 6 is that there isn't modding support. It's really fun, but I'd really love to see uh, people making custom assets, with, like different decorations for islands and stuff. I could see that. Maybe someday soon they'll add modding support. I also want to try the Teleferic Station. It sounds awesome to have cable cars go from one island to the next. Hmm. Do I use all this money to unlock nuclear power? I think I do. Alright, we unlock nuclear power and then we buy it eventually. We're going nuclear! Speaking of... Is there any place with uranium? Well now, there is uranium. Right here, no less. And tenements. Oh, I can't afford. Hopefully there's a bus stop here. I forget if I place a bus stop. This place is actually rather bustling for a mining town. It has a tavern. Let's increase the pay for all the taverns. From $6 to $7. Job happy- look at this! I'm doing- I'm doing great, okay? Change the game title for you, boss? Thank you! Look at this! Job happiness is the least, um, cared for so far, and it's just 54. That's the lowest number we have. Everything else, as far as happiness goes, goes between 54 and 65. Crazy. Now, healthcare happiness is going down. I will eventually invest in a hospital. <clears throat> Lowest standing is religious with just 50. So, I'm, I'm doing well. I'm largely liked by everybody. That makes me feel pretty good. I don't see a bus stop. All right. Since I don't see a bus stop here, I may want one. Or maybe I get the metro station out here. Where is that? Metro station. Oh, it requires that much power, right. Not yet, then.
something like this and then get it quick built. Thank you. That's built now. Good, good. All right, and it already has a worker. So, starting. Let's say it starts somewhere around here and near the center. And then, oh, <gasps> no, no, I didn't mean to. I demolished it. That's okay. A fresh shipment will fund this again. Okay. Now. Bus stop. That's the start. It ends. Near the center of town. It is quite a trek. Yes. Hilarious. No! These tend to operate at a loss, even with the ticket to ride. Yeah, it's not... It, it's... Oh, minus 10. Yeah. It's a little rough. Power shortage in network. 40... Uh, 64 megawatts missing. Why is that? Does the power reach you? Oh, it does not. Not even close. Quick build it. Quick build. There we go. We got power to you. And what's that like? Zero plus zero network balance. It is perfectly in the balance right now. As all things should be. gonna get you a power drill oh not a power drill we can't afford it actually just a canary and that's the worker okay so for that since people seem to like this area I say we place a tenement here The road. Ooh, I can't do that. Damn. Alright then. How about a tenement here? And a road like this. Yes. Because the bus stop is right here. People want to be able to, uh, just get to their home. Look look at the demand for this bus. I'm glad I placed it. That's one hell of a bus stop. That's smart placement. If it's getting used a lot, that's good. Look at this. So many passengers, and they're on their way to the circus and the entertainment The citizens district. are demanding elections, Presidente. It seems that they want a choice in how they are ruled. So selfish. So selfish, I know. I will deliver an amazing speech. We have 58% approval. I will acknowledge job happiness. Because I already am working on it. Oh, wow. I already have higher standing with the co uh, communists. When did that happen? Oh, because I'm producing furniture. That was their demand. Let's praise the industrialists. They're really uh, bringing up our our money and our ability to support higher classes. From poor to well off. 
let's not blame anyone. And let's see, promise improvement in the improvement in job happiness. I'm working on it. My friends, my people, welcome to a golden age of prosperity for every living tropican. It was your trust that made it possible. Your trust of me, El Presidente. Of course, life is tough for those without jobs. I understand. My job is everything to me. But soon, my people, everyone will have tolerable pay, bigger bosses, and harder work. Without a doubt, Tropico must grow. We owe so much of our prosperity no one's to coming the industrialists. To listen. They create jobs and commerce and take... Okay, we have radio now. Income. Everyone's listening at home on the radio. I hear you ask, what of our employment? Your Presidente has told every Tropican boss how to fix all work problems and how to make more jobs. I shall hold them all accountable if work conditions do not improve. So vote El Presidente for the future that you deserve. All of you. Viva Tropico! Whoa, that's a big cheer. Everyone likes it. All right, let's work on job happiness. That was a $39,000 freighter? What are they exporting here? There's a lot of cotton. We're getting a new shipment of cloth ready. Maybe I take that opportunity to build the nuclear plant. Future proof our grid. Big investment. Big investment that removes our power problems for probably over a decade. Probably two decades, maybe. Hopefully. 800 megawatts. And I think you can uh, upgrade that to and like give it higher budget up to like 1200, 1600, something like that. Increased job quality increases the capacity of uranium in stock. Okay, so you would be increasing budget. We gotta go. And we're positive again. Another $30,000 freighter shipment. I think it's fair to say that we are in a solid position to get in, uh, officially get into tourism and bring in some rich tourists that help us pay our people better. Anyway, this does require a college education. I'm so stressed. So, we don't have a college. Maybe it's time to get one? Oh, I can't afford one. Not yet. I can work on a TV station soon. Oh, people are working here already. Well, in that case, residential. What's your pay? $45? So you're rich. You're rich. Let's build a mansion. And that should support everyone here.
There we go. And they're pretty leisurely right now. What's happening with my phone? It's buzzing so much. Oh, Small Biscuit went live about an hour ago. I see, I see. Time for more coffee. Because this is an earlier stream, um, you may have a BRB while I make some espresso or something later on, okay? 70% approval. Look at me go. How's job happiness? Still 54. This may be hard. We are five. Look. Caribbean happiness is holding steady at 55. We are 60. We are a very happy island. I'm doing well. What's happening here? Why is the coal mines like gone? All right, we have 54 vacant jobs. A large part of them are uneducated. In that case, uh, where are you? Custom immigration office. Let's open doors again. Fair enough. I had op uh, opened more positions. I'm sure the good citizens of Tropico intend to vote for you, Presidente. Allow them to vote freely, please. Once we start with the corrupt actions, they will catch on and it becomes harder and harder to keep the democracy going. Ooh. Well, that's a cloth export. Look at this revenue. $208,000. 780. That's a good trade. Now, what else could you do for me? Hmm? What else could we secure? Bananas and goods. I could start canning some goods. I could do fish. I think we buy another trade license so we can do two of these. Hides? We don't have many hides. Uranium. I could do that. Let's sign the biggest contract for the uranium and the biggest contract for the fish. Because we can most certainly do that. We have three fishermen's wharves. All right, I expect us to be making big cash from that. How is this not connected to the road? Excuse me? Excuse me. Your judgment is always impeccable, Presidente, but might I make a tiny suggestion? Yes. There seems to be a lot of pollution on your island. The pollution overlay shows you the most polluted areas in red. You can decrease pollution by building garbage dumps or waste treatment facilities. Winds polluted entertainment, residential, and tourism buildings. I'll accept that task. Thank you for the guidance, Penultimo. I can always count on you. There we go. Now you're connected. And you. Nope. Stop. Damn it. Where did the... Ah, where did the bus go? Now we need to find that bus. Is it you? Where's the stop? Okay, there's the start. 
Do we see a stop? If we don't see a stop, then... Oh, there. Okay. That's one bus. Damn. Okay, this is gonna be almost impossible. But... It's connected now, so that's always good. Uh... Because then we could, that means we can uh, ship the uranium in and this can start operating. So, where is it? Island? Bus lines. Oh. Alright, so the ending one is still there. Cool. So I just needed to replace it here. Oh, very good. Very good. Anyway. Trade route completed. Oh, that's Our the clock. comrades, rejoice in your support, Presidente. And of course, we all rejoice equally. Thank you, thank you. Let's take the plus five communist standing, just to help. And that increased our support from, what was that, 68% to 78%? Something crazy like that. Okay, so, the communists. I have a lot of communists in the uh, on the island. Look at all that the radio station affects. The election is a landslide, Presidente. The metaphorical kind, not the kind that accidentally reduces the size of the workforce. Beautiful. 383 loyal Tropicans voted for you. 52 voted for your rival. Melly, bwah! Bwah, bwah! Bwah, 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 Alright, and a hydrate. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. It's happening again. It's happening again. Wow, what a fierce. Wah. Yes, a wah. <laughs> what a fierce wah. ASMR? I don't know how effective ASMR is here, Sailu, with all the trumpets going on in the background, but. We can tone it down. We can uh, lower the volume a little bit for a couple minutes. Okay, this is such a well-built island, if Presidente, you ask me. Oh. I know you always keep your promises, but the citizens today can be very They want 65 job happiness in promise. 10 years. That's crazy. Wait a second. It's at 53. How do you expect that to be fulfilled? Wait a second. Could I do an edict for that? Decreases conservative standing by 10%. By 10. I don't know what that means. Uh, we don't have a conservative faction. I think that's for modern times. I'm trying to see here. It's okay. I'm also playing Tropica 6 as well. So it's Trumpets of Plenty. Yes, it is. Ooh, free wheels. Zero dollars? Oh, it costs $1,000 a month. Increases communist standing by 10. Decreases capitalist standing by 15. Hmm. I'm trying to think of what could help with job quality.
Ah, uh, yes. Increases job quality of each workplace by 15%. Decreases the efficiency of all workplaces by 12%. And decreases the pollution of all workplaces by 10%. Right. We do mandatory siesta for a quick one. A quick gain in that. In job quality. I just need to be positive again. Please? Oh, that's a big ask, apparently. Here, can I ask for financial aid from the embassy? Yes, I can. All right, edict. Work Mandatory siesta. Hard, and nobody appreciates that more than you, Presidente. You've never had to do a day of hard labor in your life, and you aren't about to start now. As a show of goodwill to the citizens of Tropico, a mandatory two-hour siesta is to be declared after lunch. Yes. It is not a great recipe for productivity, but it sure breaks up those long afternoons slaving away. With this edict, you snooze, but you do not lose. Indeed. We have mandatory siesta now. We could also do food for the people. Aren't you tired of lied, svelte citizens who are all skin and bones? By doubling food rations, you can make everyone happy. Yes. Well, except for the wealthy tycoons whose market economics thrive on scarcity. But everyone else will be mildly pleased at your generous gesture. Besides, it will be years before the detrimental health effects of chronic obesity will get noticed. Right? Right. All right. Let's get these for your increased... Hopefully this helps with, like... But this helps food quality. Increases general food quality by 10. And then this is increases the uh, job quality of each workplace by 15%. Hopefully it gets better because as you have these active longer, you see these stars, they level up. And the good effects become better. The negative effects become lesser. Anyway, warfare, let's see what that did for job quality. Insanity. A new report from the palace says classified. Oh yes, and I should cleanse buildings. That's right. What is that? A public service? Yeah, it's a garbage dump. Yeah, we do have a bit of pollution here. Damn. Is there any good place for it? Here? Hmm. actually pretty hard. Hmm. Maybe I do this. That's a decent bit of uh, pollution reduction. How are you doing? Over here? You have no one. Why is that? Power shortage. Well, this isn't producing any power. Why is that? We have one worker here. Let's increase the, uh, the pay for mines by a whole dollar. Increase the minimum wage of all the mines, one dollar. Yep. Increase it by another dollar, too. 
with big pocketed boiler suits. Increases efficiency by 10% for all of them. It has produced. Not much though. Alright, job, job happiness is going up. We have homelessness. Let's put a tenement down here? Sure. We need this uranium mine to, like, go. We need it active. If possible. Where's the worker? He's not there. So where is he? I don't see him. I can see the tenement being built in the distance. Let's hire foreign workers then. So we've given... Alright. We're slowly increasing job happiness. We've given everyone mandatory siestas. We've increased... Um, let's see. We've increased pay for mo uh, all the mines by $1 to $2. It's gone up to 50 Seven happiness. Oh yes, by the way, how is research? Ooh, we have a lot of research available. Hmm. We could have a national day. independent allows you to strengthen the propaganda effect from media buildings to allow them to earn more money really and college work modes casino work modes bank work modes TV station work modes We do have a theater right there. We do have the movie theater though. Ooh, you know what? Let's do that. And then immigration. Let's see, what else? Souvenir shop. Yes, let's do this for tourism. Nuclear plant, TV station, tourist port. Thank you. Alright, so the movie theater research is complete. So we have Blockbuster. Let's pause. That's basic settings. Let's see, Karma 4. That help aids the... Uh, it shifts people's uh, political orientation toward environmentalists. All right. Uh, industrialists, communists, capitalists. Okay, so that's for propaganda. Keep it on Blockbuster then. Never mind. What would theater do? El Presidente, the musical, increases upkeep by 20%. Each citizen visiting has a chance to increase their approval. No tourists prefer the building. Decreases the fee by 20%. The required economic wealth is poor. 
Each citizen oriented towards the intellectual faction, because the theater has a chance to increase the standing of the corresponding faction by one. Is anyone even there? Oh yeah, it's full. It's had almost a thousand visitors in its lifetime. It's at, and it's still not making money, really. just have a poor network balance and we can't seem to get anyone in the fat in the plant it's really expensive to operate it's already cost twenty thousand dollars let's do minimum budget on it oh that instantly decreased our uh oh man that instantly decreased job happiness you're kidding me where are the workers? You don't see the Oh, there they are. They're in the bus? I see. And one of them apparently walked all the way here. Incredible. Is it possible to import some uranium? 40, it's marked up 45%. How do you get away with that? Jeez. Oh boy, so I can only import pineapple and oil from our allies. Bananas, canned goods, cars. We can import cars? What would that do for us? Can we even turn the cars into something? Because I have no idea. Turn the cars into worse trains. True. All right, we have thirty thousand dollars expected from this shipment. I feel like it may start getting more efficient to have another dock. It just might become more efficient. This has printed money. Good God. And it's always, almost always maxed out because of all these logging camps over here. Are they well employed? They're well staffed. Good. Alright, so there's the money. This has made money too. And you? Yep, you've made a lot of cash flow. You? Lots of cash flow. Good, good. All right, you. You have produced some uranium, finally. That means a teamster should be on their way at some point soon. Maybe through the port. Yep, here they come. Here come the teamsters, and then they'll probably try to get this to the, the plant. Honestly, come to think of it, this plant is poorly placed. It should have been near the mining town. 
but oh well. These have made so much money. Honestly, they've made enough money that I might make a jewelry shop. Yeah, something funky like that. I like it. It's weird, but I like it. I like it because it's weird. No, that's a, that's a terrible place. Here. Let's have it... Like this. Right in the middle of the gold town. This game always makes me want to replay Mario Sunshine. I like you because you're weird too. Weird and cute. What? I'm not weird. Not one bit. Oh my god. I've used up half the time available for job happiness. And it's still not there. Our immigration office is gone. What? What? We must have a lot of jobs available because 14, 11, 11 immigrants and there's still only five unemployed citizens. So we have vacant homes in the poor and well-off section. But we still have homeless families in the broke section. I can't afford social security yet. Maybe when I get the... Uh, Maybe when I get this station online. Yeah? Yeah, let's get the, the television station online. And request financial aid. Wow, that went quick. So, does this still not have any stock? No, it takes a while for them to get there. However, the uranium has been taken. And now the workers are on their, on the bu at the bus stop, ready to be taken home, I guess, because they don't live here. God knows why. I'm sure this takes a lot of passengers. Yeah, that's pretty decent. It's relatively new, so that is a pretty decent rate. Let's increase the wages of all bus uh, drivers. There we go. Grocers. Apples. Yeah, let's increase their wages. Yeah. So that's chapels and what about churches? Increase wages. Help with that job happiness a little bit. You two. Uh, increase your pay. Yes. Have you been producing? You have been producing. Oh, that is such high margins. Why haven't I done this before? The planks are almost maxed out in storage. We're making so many. Butter eater? I am a butter eater. Hey. That's a weird thing to call me. Adds an additional stock for plastics of 8,320 8, capacity. The building uh, requires an additional 35 megawatts of power. Oh, it's working. We have a positive network balance of 63 now. You know what that means? We increase the output. Ooh, that's an $18,000 deposit and 135 megawatts for nine mines. 
but increases all of their efficiencies by 25%. I will take that. Thank you. And what about you? I can't do power saws yet. <clears throat> it's storage is almost max. They're getting those planks out the door as fast as they can from all these logging camps. A shack. Really? Is there a bus stop here? Not yet. How's the radio station? You? Alright. Let's see what we could do make from you. What can we make from you? Slightly increases approval rating the approval of citizens living in electrified buildings in the vicinity of the TV station every time they rest. Decreases liberty by 30. Hey TV, you earn $10 for each citizen living in electrified buildings in the vicinity each time they rest. Decreases liberty by 5. Okay, pay TV, go. Show me what you've got. Show me what you can make. Oh my god, so much money. So much cash flow from a newspaper. Look at this, 116,000 lifetime income. And then where's the radio station? Here. $22,000 lifetime income. And then you. Already a thousand. Almost fifteen hundred. Making nine hundred fifty dollars of income a month. Propaganda success? Oh my god. Alright, we only have a thousand days left to increase job quality. Another six. That's wild. But Every time I add more propaganda, this just keeps going up and up, up. Oh, this tenement is just in range. Perfect. This area isn't really in range for any of the propaganda, though. Kind of a shame. That means I should be placing them in on this island. Yes? How's this doing? 19 vacant jobs still. 6 college ones. 13. The vacant jobs are decreasing dramatically though. I didn't even realize there were 70 vacant jobs. This logging camp is mostly... Alright, keep the immigrants coming. Not in range of propaganda. <laughs> I know, right? This tenement isn't in range of propaganda. How dare it? I kind of want to raise the pay of all of these. The newspaper, the radio station, they're all so effective. Just do it. Do it. I earn $8 each time someone rests from that one, $10 from this, and $5 from this one. Oh, they increase in range with each tier. They're like different tiers of the same thing. I see. I see, I see. Already over $4,000. It's been operational for what? I don't know. But that propaganda success is pretty crazy. That's wild. Over 5000 Cash flow. Cash flow. And what about you? You're still almost maxing out on planks constantly. 
So I could churn out more and more furniture. This is a very high margin. Same with the logging camp. So I could do power saw whenever I'm positive again for an increase of 30% efficiency. And you, an increase of 100% efficiency later. But for now, ah, I, I actually can't. We need plastics. Can we make plastic? Plastics plant. It emits much pollution. police officer. Is there a bus stop? I see this bus coming. Oh, I do have a bus stop here. This nuclear plant is so... <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. It's so expensive. Minus $40,000 already. It's only been operational for a few years, so that's definitely eaten into the island's margins. I was just looking at you. How did you catch on fire? No matter. The firefighters are, are, are already on it. They're so efficient. Look at this guy running to get grab his truck. Look at this guy. And then out comes a fire truck. Wonderful. Alright. How's homelessness? Ooh. Only two unemployed citizens, but 52 homeless citizens. All right, wait, what's that mean? Only eight vacant jobs are left. Okay, immigration's office. We close the borders, close off immigration. We need long range propaganda drones. It's true. I'm not going to make it. I only have two years left. And I still need six, uh, five more job happiness. Maybe this? Uh, increase? Yeah. Yes, this is very high margins. Holy shit. Over two, over three hundred thirty thousand dollars. All right. In that case, yes, this uh, textile mill. Thank you. Yeah, increase things around here in general. The big employers. Where are they? There's no one here. This has made no money. There you go. Get get more money. All of you. What else employs a lot of people? I don't know. Just hopefully that helps with the job quality. Oh, you. Yes, increase efficiency by much for all the ranches. And you? We do have a lot of farmers. There you go. Increase job happiness. Hopefully this helps. We have very slim margins, if any. Ah, I don't know if we even do have margin. Wow, 
Twenty-one thousand. Okay. We're shipping all of these planks. Hi. So many more planks. We could be shipping out more furniture. All right. Well, we have a lot of homeless. So, tenement. Something like that. Thank you. Very effective bus stop. When it comes around, you. How many have you actually carried? It's from you. Oh, almost 2,500 passengers. Uh, I'm sorry, 4,500 passengers in a lifetime. Oh, we've run out of uranium. The Eastern Bloc sent us foreign aid. What do you mean? We're from the. We like the Western powers. I. Oh man, just under two years. Actually, just a year and a half, and I have no idea how to increase that housing quality. Wow, I can't afford this. Damn. Adding six job positions would help with these six unemployed citizens. Um. I seriously don't know. Uh, job happiness is up there with the best of them. Liberty happiness is still really high. It's the highest now, 71. Food happiness at 62. Job happiness, 61. Um, healthcare happiness, 59. Housing happiness, 57. Fun happiness, 55. Crime safety happiness, 55. Faith happiness, 50. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to make it. Oh well. Oh, it went up one? Only three more. Come on. Three more. And then I'll, lo I'll lower payback. Back down. Because I can't sustain this. At least not right now. Unless I get into the tourism. What if I did get into the tourism? Where is it? Uh, public services. No, tourism. Tourist port here. Then maybe we have a beach house. Nope, we can't do that. Uh, well off or better? I could maybe do this one. And then maybe a motel. Yes, very good. See if we can bring in the tourists finally. Alright, we're gonna go really negative from this. What did you ship out? The church is on fire. Oh, you shipped out the furniture. I see, I see.
That TV station is one of our biggest earners right now. That and the t that the uh, furniture factory and the textile mill, as well as all the other propagandas. There goes another freighter. Why don't we take that opportunity while it's out for this fine fabric rolling? It costs. It uses extra power, but it increases efficiency by ten percent. Very nice. Alright, and that opens up jobs for us. Ah, uh, under a year with three more to go? I don't think I make it. What kind of unemployed people? High school level? I see. Alright, we open the borders again. And our first tourist? Ten tourists! Our first 10 looking to uh, scout the place. There they go. Welcome, welcome. I think for that area, maybe you uh, enjoy a nice park. Can you not? Something like this. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Thank you, Melly. Why? 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 What is that? I is that a llama? I don't know. It makes me giggle every time. Woo! Thank you for the hydrate, Salu. Now, there really should be a bus stop to bring y'all into the center of everything. There's a fire. Don't worry about it. No residents? All the residents are here. So no one wants to be here, huh? Is that what I'm seeing? Alright, five... Okay, there's nine uneducated jobs left that are open. All right, so it has made some money already. Hmm. Upkeep is increased by 50%, but housing quality is increased by eight. Relaxation tourists prefer this building. I see. A ceiling fan and requires 10 megawatts of power. Damn. But increases efficiency by 25%. We'll see. We don't have much l yet to invest in that. Mini bars? Ooh. Increases the overall happiness of tourists arriving by five. Good. I think so. Or a normal bar for ports. What? No! A mini bar is not a normal... 
God, I, uh, uh, what? I can't believe it. Betrayed. Melly regularly betrays me with burns like this. I can't believe it. Nice tourist spot, if you ask me. Maybe I'm biased. Who knows? But what's the beauty rating now? Oh, we entered the 70s. Happy 70s, everybody. Beauty? It's increased. Butterflies increases service quality by five. Child tourists will also prefer this building. Sure, I could do that. Service quality went from 30 to 35. You know, racing a mouse symbol of rum wouldn't floor you. I am saying that. No, I can I can have four rums just fine. What? I can't wait to increase efficiency by 100% in the modern times. Oh well, anyway. You may have noticed. That our time on the, uh, on, on the what? Well, um, what was I just talked about? Oh yes, our time doing the, uh, uh, trying to increase, uh, co uh, job quality timed out, unfortunately. So now it's up to us to, uh, decrease efficiency. No, okay, don't increase, decrease efficiency for those. Here, you can, you can decrease efficiency of these, though. Okay, no. They make so much money, it's fine. Okay, so, what about you? Yeah, we have- we, yeah, we can spend less on you for now. Like, you're crazy. At this point. Efficiency 67% and you, we still have a network balance positive almost 300 megawatts. We're fine for now. Make that money. All of you? You know what? Yeah, you can keep that wage. Yeah, that's fine. I think the main thing was just like defunding the power plants a little bit. Like, look at that. We're not nearly as uh, negative as we once were. It's a, well, at least it's not so sensitive because of the huge budget of the... <laughs> nuclear plant. And there we go. All the mines make a little less money again, but uh, they already have po over 100% efficiency, so it's fine. Oh yes, I want to get the power saw when I can. What an adorable lightweight boy. Bwah! Oh, another tourist ship with 10 people? Really? Oh, and we have some people in the cabana. 
This one's actually making money. That's crazy. And they're enjoying the park? Yeah, Hello, the old guy. Citizens are demanding oh. elections, President. An election, it you say? They want the choice. Already? Again? Yeah, I can't promise improvement. Let's praise. Oh, the capitalists aren't doing so well. Let's praise the industrialists. And acknowledge the issue of. Faith, happiness? Sure. My friends, you are the dedicated ones for whom no hardship is too great. Through Tropicans, your tribulations shall be rewarded with just a little more effort. Your Presidente does not ignore your faith. You need places to pray, to confess your sins, and to nap before Holy Communion. God is everywhere, but it is unwise to worship outside in hurricane season. Without a doubt, True. tropical must grow. We owe so much of our prosperity to the industrialists. They create jobs and commerce it's true. and take only a little in return. So vote El Presidente for the future that you deserve. All of you, Viva Tropico! This thing's making us $1,000 a month. What about you? $100 a month? And then you? $280 a month. This thing is a huge earner. 15, uh, almost 1,200 this month? Jeez. More tourists, 10 more. Good, good. The cabana is full. The motel, full. All right, we're starting to make some tourism money. Maybe I put out a beach villa? Uh, what else? A tour office. Hmm, souvenir shop? I'm thinking one of each, if possible. Souvenir shop and tour office. Like that? Sure. <laughs> All right. That's a good place for uh, tourism. What else we could do is a parking deck for tourists. Allows all tourists to access and park cars or taxis. There you go. That's a basic start to tourism. Wah. I'm no lightweight. Ooh, yes, an arcade? Where? I want an arcade. I can't have it. Why is it so hard to have things now? Is this pig even usable? 54% efficiency, but it's still working well. This one's having a hard time working too. And you? Oh, garbage dump. Huh. Somehow still working. Oh, they are actually traveling back here to plant the trees. I see. Hmm. 
civic garbage collection? I don't know. Anyway, it seems to be doing its job. How is pollution? Electricity is great. Uh, pollution? Not bad. Not one bit. Oh, this is bad though. bad. Yeah, I've not been kind to the forests of this base island. Coconuts are now mostly extinct here. Soil degradation. Not bad. Metros? None. Bus line. We have quite a few. This tends to be the ends, and then there's a pickup one. Look at this one. I bet that's to take them to the other side of the island, in the other residential district. Fire in the distance. Don't worry, they got it. Here we go. And someone should be around to, uh, repair it shortly. Another ten tourists. Really? Oh, ASMR. That didn't sound uh, convincing at all, hun. Oh. Oh, heck. Okay. I see how it is. Well, ASMR. All right. How do you like that ASMR? With the trumpets in the background? Hopefully it's picking up all my voice. I don't know. I do have a noise gate on. What? It's very funny. Oh no. Bwah, bwah, bwah. Thelu, bwah. Bwah, bwah. I really like the idea of just a bus stop terminal. Maybe I'm the only, I hope I'm not the only one that likes that idea. A bus stop terminal in the middle of um, just this entertainment district. Hm. I like it, yeah? Good. We already have some uh, visitors here. And the motel? Not making much, but it is enough to be positive. Same with this one. What about the beach villa? No one? Okay. Yeah, it's not making any. What, what kind of tourism can we expect? Modern times is for airports? Okay. Well, since we have money... Oh, right. I wanted you. I wanted the power saw. Boop. Can't get anything else. What do you mean there are... Like, oh, wait. You don't have stock again. Damn it. Why don't you have stock? Here, increase your job quality by 15. That's huge job quality. And and that's with, like, zero budget. Low budget. But you, need, you seriously need to have some uranium. Can we import...
We can import uranium at no markup. You know what? I think I want that. Ugh, yeah. Purchase that. There we go. We have some extra uranium. How are the Teamsters doing? That's one Teamsters office. What about this one? Oh, add a second shift for six more job positions? I think so. Are there any other mines we could have here? Nickel. Oh no, that's iron. Iron and nickel. Well, we might as well uh, complete the mining town. That brings up the question, I don't know where... This is a, tour a small tourist place, right? You have the entertainment district, you have this. Great for the tourists. I think this ends up being a tourist beach. And maybe this side also ends up being tourist uh, tourism focused. With some residential areas for my own people to uh, staff, the air, uh, staff the places. Always good to have extra glowy rocks around to make your insides feel warm and fuzzy. I do like a nice solid glow stick. Where are your workers? Oh, they're in town. Well... Don't worry, we're working on getting tourists to visit and that will bring us to modern times. Eventually. Alright, politics. Oh boy. You know what? I could expel you and bring in the Eastern Bloc and ask for financial aid. Bring you down to 52 relation. Hm. There we go. Alright, so now we're with the Eastern Bloc and got another $20,000 in the bank. Thank you very much. Really want to get that heartwarming holiday spirit. Put some of your extra uranium in the stocking. It's true. I'm sure the good oh. citizens of Tropico intend to vote for you, Presidente. I myself intend to vote for you many, many times. Uh, allow the citizens to continue to vote freely, please. What if we added another Teamster port here? Maybe that'll help with the Teamsters shipping things? How's homelessness? Ooh. And it's broke people, poor, well off. Okay. Oh, yes. How's vacancy? Uh, vacant jobs? Only five. You know what? Let's do Tropico first again. That's a lot of planks you're shipping out. Are you sure about that? It could be furniture. Man, this is going slow, though. How are our edicts going?
Well, uh, oh, they're both two star. Okay. Increases communist standing by five. Capitalist standing by 10. Uh, reduces capitalist standing by 10. Increases general food quality by 15. Look at this. Increases job quality of each workplace by 20% while decreasing efficiency by 8%. Good. What does that mean for our job happiness? It's still up at 61. Faith happiness keeps rapidly decreasing. Wealth? How's wealth? It's... I brought in more uneducated workers. I see, I see. Only 10 broke people. Uh, 414 poor. The election is oh. a landslide, Presidente. They were the a landslide, you kind, say. Not the kind that accidentally reduces the size of the workforce. Indeed, not at all. All right, let's increase efficiency of these uh, fishermen's wharfs. I mean, there's not many workers there, and it, uh, maximizing efficiency only increases their wage $2, really. Alright, I could actually supply local market with the three I have. Uh, the efficiency of each gourmet restaurant is increased by 10% on medium budget. Hmm, fishing dredge. How's this doing? Still, a lot of planks, uranium, and jewelry. Ooh, the jewelry is working. This is actually going to be our our biggest sale yet. How's the jewelry factory going? Good? Decreases job quality by 10%, increases production by 10. Well, we are maxing out the gold here. Good. There's the workers. They're all out here. Just normal. Just normal. Oh my gosh. Let's see if I say this right. Jin Lights, thank you so much for the follow. Did I say it right? Did I get it right the first time? Let me know. Welcome, welcome. Okay, we're a bit frozen right now because we've maxed out our bank account. That's okay. Just wait for this massive sale to bring us to like, what, 20, uh, 30,000 positive? Oh, and the Eastern Bloc sent us for uh, foreign aid. Good. Good, good. Great. And there it is. Thank you for the export. Thank you for the jewelry. How's your day been, huh? Jin Light, tell us a little about yourself. How are you doing? Lots of iron and nickel. Yes, I think this part of the budget gets spent on mines. So many mines. There we go. And at that point, I think it's worth having another Teamsters office. 
So, Teamsters. There we go. Yes, let's bring them here. And a few tenements. The president they announces a new snitch for cash program. Report something suspicious today. And an and apartment. You could win fabulous cash prizes. Yes. With maybe some decorations. Increase the beauty of the mining town. Really? It's that hard to increase the beauty around here. Come on. We will make it beautiful. I insist we make it beautiful. Okay. Anyway. Maybe that's enough. Although at that point, I might also want... Another bus garage. And quick build. All right, place the starting around here. Place the ending in the vicinity of, yes, right in the middle here. There we go. Yes, a lot of our citizens end up using uh, public transportation. Actually, the starting should be more like here. Good. That's another mining town. We have two mining towns to help further fuel our growth for the tourism to be, you know, uh, further off to the sides. Who knows where? And none of those can compare to the absolute gem that is you. Aw, Melly. Thank you so much. Blah. The research completed on immigration. Really? Thank you. Can I make that uh, immigration policy? Love it or leave it decreases the chance of unhappy citizens staying in Tropico by 50%. I like that. Free to go. Hmm. Best country on earth. Citizens are not allowed to immigrate. I think we love it or leave it. Maybe that increases my overall support, yeah? Let's see what happens to the population. One left. The port actually did go up a little bit. Did you see that? Yeah, we got two immigrants, so. Oh well. Anyway. That mansion built, finally. And someone immediately rents it out. Glad I built the mansion. I would like to electrify mansions. And how about you? Okay.
I don't know about electrifying all of the mines. Yeah, I can't afford to do that. Well, let's see. Let's, let's do as much as I can for it. How's the workforce? Ooh, right, we need to open the borders again. Here we go. Wait, or do we? Yes, we do. Seven college-level jobs open. And 25 uneducated. Yeah, we'll open the doors a little bit. More uranium. Really? Why are we selling all the uranium? What's this, by the way? What's this work mode? Power output decreased by 50%. Decreases the upkeep of the nuclear pro program by 20% on medium budget. The bon This bonus can be accumulated up to a cap of 60%. Increases the bomb production rate of the nuclear program by 20% on medium budget. No, thank you. Let's increase the uh, capa holding capacity of uranium. There we go. Just decrease the likelihood that it'll run out. I certainly hope this has helped. Add six job positions. Look at this. Increase uh, the speed of cargo ships by 50% for a chance to lose 5% of the freight. That's worth it. 13 workers immigrated over. And immediately this port is filled. Still 25 left to go though. Vacant homes. It's going down. Okay, these tenements are a bit too uh, empty for me. Yeah, this one's empty. Demolish it then. And this one? Okay, we demolished the empty one, but we'll keep the others because we are bringing people in, remember. Yeah, see, they instantly built a shack. They need housing. Mini bars increases efficiency by 25%. That's huge. Yes, all the power that you need. All of it. You're expensive, though. Uh, what about souvenir shop? Any upgrades? No? What about you? No? Okay. That sounds cursed. That sounds cursed. Badness forever. Thank you so much for subscribing at tier one for three months. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much for three months in advance. I didn't know you could do that. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for the subby wubby, as Nelly says. <laughs> okay. That was a big freight. Uh, around 42,000. What? 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 
sub for three months? Wow, thank you so, so much, really. It means a lot. What? What? <laughs> I do want to focus on a rich liner at some point. Oh, you know what? Maybe maybe here is our first like rich tourism spot or along here this could be like a place with a rich focus right we guild players need us to stick together it's true we do All right, politics, how's this doing? It's doing fine. Uh, broker, they call what me you do the for me? broker. I get would any yes, of these be of interest to you? It's all strictly above board, of course. You know what? I might uh, exchange $4,500 for $5,000 of the Swiss. Oh, I can't. Oh, I see. Produce oil? I could do that. All right, we're producing the oil. That'll be quick. I mean, the workers are going to work now from the bus stop. At least that's what I think they're doing. Let's find out. Yep, they're going on to the oil rig. And there goes the oil production. All right, what's happening over here? You've had a lot of passengers in your lifetime? Good. You don't have many people living here. Uh, what's homelessness like? It's mostly just broke people, but the edict for social security the broke people are re retired. Um, retirees and adult students receive 70-60% uh, of the average wage paid on Tropico. Currently $6. Recipients have increased personal experience by 5. Alright, you know what? I might do this. I'm thinking I do take this. Because we only have six, what, six broke people? It's just because they're retired. Everybody loves money, but there is not enough to go around. It never hurts to seem more generous than you are, and nothing is quite as magnanimous as social security. Free money without having to work for it. If you ignore the ghastly mountain of paperwork, of course. If we offer it to just the elderly and university students, we won't have to pay out to most of the population, but we'll still seem implausibly big-hearted. A nearly flawless scam. All right, and that's Social Security. Thank you very much, Penultimo. Hmm. We could also do a, a uh, tax cut. Increases the approval of all citizens. The edict costs $5 per employed citizen. The edict has a cooldown of five years. Want to get on everyone's good side? Slash taxes and worry about balancing the budget after the next election. Everyone loves having more. We'll see about that for the next election.
the farm. As convenient as it has been to have most of our citizens incapable of reading, certain judgmental nations have accused Tropico of being a backward backwater. Fortunately, it was written in a foreign newspaper, so not only did nobody here see it, they couldn't read it even if they had. However, if you decide you should like to have more citizens who could read and write, we can always throw money at the school system and see what happens. <laughs> All right, let's see what happens to the homeless. Homeless families went from broke to poor. Look at that. They instantly left the broke class and went into the poor class. I just wiped out broke, uh, broke homelessness. Now it's just poor. But that shouldn't be much of a problem. It's just that they're in their shacks. Please excuse me. Please excuse me. Yeah, they'll leave their shacks eventually. Soon enough. How's our vacant jobs? 23 of them? Alright. Our lowest standing is with environmentalists, I see. But industrialists is 84%. Look at our revenue. Oh, that's a vacant job. Never mind. I'm going to let it build up for a while. Get that bank interest. TV station giving us twelve hundred dollars a month. Crazy. And a tenement's on fire. So that means a lot of people are technically yep, homeless. Until that uh settles down. I would like to research the tourist port. Nope. Uh, just go straight to uh, the tourist port, please. And then mandatory waste sorting? That seems good. Increases all upkeep up the upkeep of all residential buildings by 20%. Reduces uh, decreases pollution by 40%. I could receive a loan of fifty thousand dollars needing to replace eighty thousand dollars over ten years. Sounds good. You gain $5 for every rich or filthy rich adult each month. Hmm. Could do that. I start stream to start two weeks ago? Oh! Wait, oh, so you started streaming two weeks ago? Is that what I'm getting? Excellent, excellent. I'm so glad there this it is. deal worked out. Two thousand dollars in the Swiss bank account. All right, broker. What else do you have for me? Do any of these offers look good to you? They're all strictly legitimate.
Let's do that. Unlock a new slot. And how about the snorkel bay? Yes, that. I can't afford that. Oh, well. All right, what's the next proposal? We'll propose a new quest in time. Okay. Sorry, environmentalists. I can't have that. We're still trying to get more tourists to visit. Uh, cleanse building. Could I trigger a demand from them? No? What if I praise them then? Let's work on a new trade. What shall the new trade be? I can do furniture. Yes, furniture, please. At a 6% markup. Great. Unfortunate that none of you want uh, cloth. Oh yeah, we're bringing in lots of immigrants. Uh, do we need them? Unemployed citizens? Oh man, what do you mean 72 vacant homes? Alright, vacant jobs? No more of those. We just have college students uh, looking for jobs now. Oh! No, we lack college students for vacant jobs. I see. We could put down some education for a college. And then maybe a little bit of... Uh, infrastructure for that quick build thank you okay starting stop would be here Yes, I want I wanted to meet up with this terminal so that people can uh, come from the other square, get over here, and go to college. Boop! There we go. What else could we do? Indeed. I think perhaps the steel mill is great. Process coal and iron to produce steel. We could do that. But we could also do is plastics. So just have these unlocked and ready. Ask for financial aid so we're positive again. Oh, you don't have power? That's fine. You still work at efficiency, right? Uh, just a lower efficiency? You don't need that, right? Hopefully not. Do want residents here. 
Wait, do I? I mean, these are full. Maybe I do. Yeah. Okay. Look at the buses go. For the most part, all the uh, cars on the road are teamsters and buses. However, tourists can get a car. How many have visited? Six visitors in its lifetime. Wow, people just prefer the bus. I see. And is it making money? It is making money. Both of these are positive, and you? Nope, the beach villa is still negative. How about we demolish it for now? Sorry, my BRB, my BRB lasted one hour. That's okay. Take your time. Do what you want. Yes, so you did President, start streaming. There well, is a madness, flaw, I'll have to check it out. Military machine. We do not have enough of the things that I want. Oh, one moment. I'm tabbing out. Boop. There you go. There's a flaw in our military machine. We do not have enough of the things that I want. Have a nuclear program? No. No, thank you. <laughs> what I can do, though, is issue a tax cut. Want to get on everyone's good side? Yes, I do. And I have the money to buy their good side. It is so also issue this edict. What else? Yes, I think maybe a right to arms. And the Tropico Papers? What does this do? Tropican citizens at filthy rich wealth level don't pay any rent. Instead, 15% of, of what they would pay in rent goes to your personal Swiss bank account every month. The personal uh, experience of every Tropican living within range of media buildings operating operating on the... Oh, I see. I see. Oh, no, no. All right. And everyone likes that. Everyone in my demographics, that is. So now our lowest is environmentalists and militarists. I see, I see. Oh, we're still bringing in a lot of people. Do we need those people? Uh, still vacant jobs, but those are... Those are highly educated people. So, we just have a college in the works. For now. Wait. Ah, I see. We might need to just bring a college person here. To help out the uh, plant. There you go. You can see a bunch of teens getting a college education. Wonderful. Oh my goodness. Hazuki Celestia. Thank you so much for the follow. Well, <laughs> I hope you've had a wonderful week so far. How's it treated you, huh? Tell us a little about yourself. Your favorite food. Drink snack what do you do for a living worship plus 11 okay we've had 110 
tourists visit. I think our major bottleneck now is Greetings, not enough. Presidente, oh. and all listening spies. I assure you all that no sensitive information Build a will hospital be transmitted near the during this embassy? conversation. I accept it. I was thinking of the healthcare happiness anyway. But for now, I want another motel. And maybe a hotel. Yeah? Help us get our foot in the door with that tourism since we have this entertainment district, the entertainment block, and then tourism. You know, the tourist dock, the tourist housing. It's a pretty enclosed, nice system if you ask me. Though it shouldn't really go much further. Because this place is pretty ugly and it'll get uglier. It'll get polluted. <laughs> Anyway, maybe with so much money under our belt, we work on a tourist port here. And this could be a rich area. What, what did you have for breakfast, new friend? Yeah, what was your breakfast, huh? Oh, I see. So cancel that construction. It says... So this is for rich guests. So this is a desirable place for them, apparently. I mean, yeah, we could do that. Here. Souvenir shop? I think so. Yeah, just just stack them up. And then what we could do is have a landing for tourists and citizens get to get in a boat and travel to the mainland. Yeah? For that case, they could do the same here. Although I think we need to research. That's not research. This is research. Wait, have we researched the port? The tourist port? Yeah, we have the luxury liner available now. Landing, okay. And then another tourist port, if you please. Hmm. Yes, I think that'll do. And 
Eh, you know what? Maybe we cancel construction on this tourist court. We just let them sort of rent out this space. What's this? They cannot reach this construction site. Oh, they actually need a connection with bridges and such? Oh boy. How would that work? Apparently this doesn't work. I don't know why. Why doesn't it work? Something weird like this? Okay, something weird like that, so that we can have a rich person's district here. Yes, yes. Um, more of the tourism? I don't know. Anyway, let it be done. I'm just gonna quick build this since we're so cash flow rich. Apparently we already have I... some workers, but well, whatever that was, no idea. Speaking of, uh, can we get cocktail bar, like, uh, yeah, cancel these. I want cocktail bar, ca uh, casino, snorkel bay, and restaurant, please. Ooh, gourmet restaurant? Yes. All right, I think these workers here should have some tenements nearby. And then, ba -ba -ba -ba. maybe uh, some decoration. No? I have no idea then. It, it just has a natural beauty to it. So, tourism. Well off or better, rich or better. Hmm, entertainment? Luxury entertainment. Well off, rich or better. Okay, well off or better. Let's have this one. Yes. And then, nightclub, no. Well off or better, well off, well off, well off, well off. Oh, this one's rich. Oh yeah, the yacht clubs, they're so good. Those things are money machines. Residential. 
apartment. Metro station. And the metro station first comes out here. Indeed. Oh yes, and uh, the substation. That's important. Oh, you actually have power. Good. Alright, let's build one here then. I don't have the money. DJ Stuki, can you send me a message in Portsy's Discord to plan a uh, tropical multiplayer game sometime? Done. Heck yeah. What? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> blah. I do like the blahs. Do I still have coffee? I still have coffee. Oh my goodness. Okay. So these are still in progress, huh? Oh, minus 25,000. There we go, a $54,000 uh, export. That's what I'm looking for. All right, and you, not economy liner. I want a luxury liner here, if you please. And yes, uh, a dispenser for that. A quick build of all of these. Thank you. And then can I have air conditioning for all of them? Thank you. A tour ship of 34. Oh, we already have people here. <gasps> So historical. It's so historical. And you're all going to the gourmet restaurant, right? No, you're all walking? Where? Where are you walking? I have no idea where you're going. Where are you going? I, I have to know now. Oh, the broker has a new thing, by the way. Export chocolate? Abandon that one. What about... Nope. Do any of these offers look good to you? They're all... Nope, none of them do. Where are you going? Don't tell me you're climbing that cliff. No! They're going around? Where are the rich people going? That wave's gonna Look crash into you. See. You can't make lemonade without a plantation and a good supply of migrant workers. <laughs> a simple man from simpler times. But he had a point and a gun. Hmm. I don't think so we need another fire station it. yet. Let's squeeze some lemons. Have you heard How about this we <laughs> he still thinks they have a childhood museum? Where are they going though, seriously? All right, Serpentine. Into the rocks, yes, do some rock climbing. Watch these just be hikers and I'm watching them for no reason.
Yeah, see, we still have like four firefighters for uh, fire trucks for every fire. They've quenched the fire. They're so quick at it. We don't we don't need to worry about firefighting right now. We could add the childhood museum though. I'm just gonna keep following. They've made it all the way around the island. They've trekked for a year, by the way. It's been an in-game year. Why? <laughs> Have I really set it up that poorly? I mean, it's making money, so if y'all are okay with it. Citizens are demanding oh. elections, Presidente. It seems that they want the choice in how they are ruled. So selfish. So selfish. I will deliver an amazing speech. No worries. So. We need increased crime safety happiness. We could do that. Playing Guild Wars 2. You're in the background. Okay. Enjoy your Guild Wars 2. Hmm. Let's praise the faction of the industrialists again. Let's pray. Let let's not blame anyone. And then promise improvements. In housing happiness. Presidente. Have oh. you seen the people who toil in this man's evil factories? They're so poor and hungry, mere cogs in his machine. With your help, they shall receive the sucker of the good book. But, my dear lady, my evil factories create opportunity for the poor and hungry. The meek shall inherit the earth. Isn't that right, Presidente? Helping me helps all of that Harridan's flock. Heriden. Well, um, I would say we were going to produce steel anyway. I think. So. E yes, let's produce steel. People of Tropico, it is I, your Presidente. Your Presidente. You have showed your faith in me, and that faith will be rewarded. Every Tropican will get what they deserve. And what of my people? I feel your pain when your walls shudder and your roofs leak. Those of you who have roofs. But soon, roofs for all and walls for many. Without a doubt, Tropico must grow. We owe so much of our prosperity to the industrialists. They create jobs and commerce and take only a little in return. What can you look forward to in the years to come? Better housing, slantier roofs, straighter walls, more transparent windows. The Tropican House of Tomorrow is built with standards. So vote El Presidente for the future that you deserve. All of you, Viva Tropico! What an amazing meteor shower. Such a shame that our neighbors were blown up by it. What? What? Why are we cheering about a meteor shower that blew up our neighbors? Um, a large number of refugees are now heading our way. We could let them in and show the world your magnanimity. Your magnum magnanimity. Or we could turn them away and show them your firm hand. Or we could build naked mermaids and encourage the refugees to start a new life under the sea. It is totally up to you, Presidente. Not today, thank you. Oh my god. In 
official statement from the palace confirms a meteor shower is going to narrowly miss Tropico. El Presidente asks for your gratitude for its majestic achievement. Okay, so increasing the housing is actually very capital intensive. We've spent $20,000 in two months to keep the housing high. So you know what? Until that election day is done, we're going to reduce the budget back to base and let it run. It did spike though. And it would spike. 17 homeless, by the way. Why is that? 58 vacant jobs. 43 of them uneducated. Lots of poor homes that are empty. In that case, we will remove them. Anything that's in the tent, in the teens, and 12, yeah, we're gonna remove you too. And that looks pretty good. There we go. And then you should see this number reduce. Yep, it's reducing. People are moving. They're consolidating. Very good. Look at that. Look at look at how just removing a couple empty tenements can uh, just collapses this. Anyway. Oh no, it it would hit the radio station, wouldn't it? By the way, we're almost at a hundred thousand. What was I gonna do? Good question. What was I really gonna do? No idea. Let's buy this for now, and the nightclub, opera house. Why not just unlock a lot of this? So they wanted a childhood museum. And what else? Uh, steel. I could do that. Let's build the steel mill while we have a boatload of cash. Literally a boatload. Right here. Because, yep, these are coal mines, as I thought. Then we'll quick build it. So, while we're over 50,000, we're at our most efficient. Because our bank does just $1,000 a month at 50,000 in interest. So, we're generating interest right now to... Uh, so, once you're over 50,000... decisive action from the um, the you generate so much more. All citizens are required you generate to an extra 12000 a year. And that's just with one bank. I can actually increase the bank number of banks and increase that interest. However, we need to open up the borders. There's not many unemployed. We do have more vacant homes. 
but there's a lot of vacant jobs. The planet is oh. in grave danger, President Hay. Surely the goddess needs us to save her now more than ever. Won't you consider going just a little green? I'm sure El Presidente is amused by your pagan nonsense, child. But this talk of going green has me seeing red. Presidente, if we're going to save something, we should start with the souls of registered voters. That's a weird argument for it. Faith is something to work on. Where's that du uh, dual demand? No. Politics? Uh, no, that's not it. What's your request? Change constitution to on topics the armed forces. No. Trade? How are how's our trade routes? We're about to complete our uranium export. Wonderful. And our fish is nowhere near done. Good. Going strong. Our uranium import is almost done. That could be bad for us. Alright, what else could we do? Where was that demand? Where can I see it? Well, I don't. Oh well. Y'all have electricity, right? No? Well, I'm gonna quick build this for you. And you have electricity. Boom! Congratulations, you have electricity. The power plant is on fire. Why is the nuclear plant on fire? That costs so much to repair. Well, we're without electricity, and our money is going down rapidly for it. Never tried it, but I feel like you'd like the... You know, I've never tried uh, squishy, rogue-type... Um, classes in really any MMO. So I do understand that thought. Like, I... How do I say this? I'm sure the good citizens of Tropico intend to vote for you, Presidente. I myself Look intend to vote for you many, approval rating, many though. times. Allow them to vote freely for me. And there's the uranium export uh, completed. In that case, oh, look at that. Let's expel the Eastern Bloc and invite the Western powers into the embassy. And then request financial aid, right? Or we could request an alliance. Triggers a, dema a demand of this superpower for zero dollars. The reward will be an alliance that prevents Tropico from being conquered by other superpowers. The allied superpower will trigger an ultimatum uh, to keep the alliance once the relationship drops below 81. The action has a cooldown of 12 months once an alliance is cancelled. Like, I've never really, uh, tried, except for the Mesmer, the Mesmer is actually the first really squishy. The water may be cold, 
And even then, it's like quote unquote squishy, right? It has a lot of tricks up its sleeve. Um, but I usually don't go for squishy classes, right? In MMOs, for just about any fantasy setting, I tend to go for tank. So maybe I should make a uh, really squishy like thief type and try it out. I just like dex builds and knives, so I imagine I'd like it. I see, I see. By the way, uh, can I? Okay, so it is working again. There, let's let's get get rid of our deficit. All right, and I'm gonna leave this at one. Oh, one moment, one moment. Oh God. Boom, I'm gone. I'm going to have a BRB. And you can watch my beautiful city do its thing. Maybe you can watch the district here. Watch the bustling inner city streets. Yeah, you tanky shield boy. <laughs> All right, and wait, building destroyed radio station. You're kidding me. Rebuild it. Quick rebuild it. That's a major part of our uh, income. Anyway, enjoy our bus station terminal. I'll be back, okay? First BRB in around four and a half hours. The election is a landslide, Presidente. The metaphorical kind, not the kind that accidentally reduces the size of the workforce. Really? Okay, well, they voted for me. That's nice. Uh, as soon as I left the room... <laughs> as soon as I left the room, I heard this, but I went along... Did some things anyway. Anyway, I'm going to do that and then continue this. Landslide, victory. Good. Oh, here comes the buses. Presidente, I know you always keep your promises, but the citizens today can be... All right. One moment.
right. Did the city behave while I was gone? Okay. Time to uh, unveil myself. Boom. Welcome. Welcome back, me. <laughs> okay, I'm here. And I think it's time, while we're working on housing happiness... Oh goodness, we're not doing well on the money, huh? There we go. All tenements have their budget increased. How's that for housing happiness? That should go up pretty rapidly. However, I will say, I think it is worth having another furniture factory right here. Potentially, you know? Yes, right next to these. And you know what? Quick build it. We need the money. Right. Unemployed citizens. Contact. Oh. Comrade. Secure this communication. Fulfill an export trade route with the Eastern Bloc. I accept. Speaking of, we have an available trade route. I would like to export. Ooh, y'all aren't giving me good options here. I'll export the jewelry. Here. Have a, have a quick little contract. Yeah, don't worry about the, uh, there's a Teamster's office right here. You don't have to worry about the plank being supplied to you. Upgrade that and upgrade the chain to chainsaws, please. 112%. Well, would you look at that? And support's going up. Money is going way down. We cannot afford this. But it makes the housing happiness better. Okay, what if we reduce the housing quality there and increase the housing quality of... And that... The cost doubles. Man. I don't know, man. I... I mm. That's actually a hard one. I thought that would be an easy one to help. Maybe I should have promised faith happiness. Because then I just build a bunch of churches. And wait. Increasing housing happiness is like a dedication, an expensive one that I can't do yet. Since my promotion, they have me working on stuff from other states, which means I get to see the diagnosis of risky heterosexual behavior again. Oh. more work but that makes me happy <laughs> all right so we have unemployed edu uneducated unemployed people that's fine this apartment's mostly empty let's demolish it All right, what else? Food happiness, it's slowly going down. Oh, right. That edict. Uh, this one.
pets at risk? Melly, get me a jorb. We do actually have two positions open, but you probably need a state license. Oh, I see. It's crazy how much the budget is increased for these homes, for tenements. Could I potentially, possibly, stack this? I kind of want to build another one and see if I can get more money. Yes, quick build. And that should instantly fill with high school students because we have had a few un uh, unemployed high school students. What state? What does state license mean? <laughs> Get the license and I'll refer you. A state license in pharmacy. Oh. I don't think it needs to be a specific state, but they prefer Cali or Texas. Okay. Interesting. So can I make can I do budget TV here? Oh my god, I can stack these. You're kidding me. It has to be unique, right? Like this is reaching these that the other one couldn't. There's no way these stack. I mean, if it's a profit. And how are you doing? What's our education rate? Education. More and more college students. Just barely, though. We Half of our people are high school educated. Well, not half of them. 25%. And wealth? I see, I see. More and more well-off people. Wait a second. How are jobs? Still vacant jobs. Okay. No more high school vacant jobs. Just uneducated one. Not many homeless families, but there are some in the poor section. Are there at least open spaces in tenements? Are they all taken? They are all taken. How about flop houses? Yeah, that's not too expensive to increase the housing quality of. Let's do that. Alright, all flop houses up. See what that does. Oh, I think we have unmet demand for apartments because there's a lot of people who are well off now, but uh, with all the uh, new manufacturing coming in and wage increase, but there, uh, there's not, that means they're well off and not poor anymore. But the tenements need a re minimum requirement of poor and have lower housing quality. 
the apartments are the op are the opposite. So I need more apartments in good places. Ah, oh, the uranium import's done. I need more. Is there any more good uranium? Plus 45%? You suck. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. There's uranium. Here's some uranium. More gold. What's this? Aluminum. You know what? We could do aluminum. I don't even know, man. Oh, we lost... We lost a beach villa? Are these making money? They are making money. Surprisingly. There's nothing out here, but they make money. Because people will pay a lot of money just to be isolated. It's true in real life, too. <laughs> At least I'm pretty sure, because I work on uh, Indiana patients, too. I see. Thank you, thank you. Man, I cannot afford to increase housing quality. It's so hard. You are barely breaking even, but you know what? That's pretty cool. All right, and we have a lifetime of 137 tourist, uh, tourist arrivals to this location, which is pretty awesome, considering that these are rich tourists. Rich tourists only. Required wealth rich here as well. It's made money. Good. Exquisite wine cellar. And here comes another one, I think. How many boats are in this archipelago? There's one, there's one. There, you, you. These. Yeah, there's a lot more boats going around. It's unfathomable how large this place is. How do I fill all of this? Like, ever. I mean, I did fill um, pretty much all of this in one stream. And some of this. Now I'm filling this up. How's the furniture factory doing? It's made money. Not as much as the other one. That might be a logistics issue. Oh, we're negative so much. Just trying to increase housing quality. How's that doing, by the way? Homeless citizens. And why are we homeless? There are poor homeless citizens. So, we need another tenement. I can't make another tenement.
Well, how we fix this is I find that flop house. Okay, wait. I find the mansions. I reduce their budget back to normal. And then flop houses? That's a clinic. Where's the flop house? You? I reduce you back to normal as well. Sorry. I have good news oh. and bad news. The good news is you set a record. The bad news is that it is for runaway national debt. Damn. Continue playing. I can fix this. I can bail us out. We're having a recession. That is okay. Because everything is making money. It's just that it turns out increasing housing quality is a an enormous task that I cannot do. Maybe not even anytime soon. But I can request financial aid. There we go. Ports, yeah, I sneezed really hard. Help. I'm sorry. I I've sneezed really hard before too. I sneezed once so hard that I got a nosebleed. Man, I can't build anything. It's just like this. Twelve tourists left. And we can play the trade route. For the export of meat. Okay. What else could we do? Corn? Rum? Logs? Uranium. I mean, I can't afford to ship out much uranium, but I'm going to sign the contract anyway because I need that money. Yes, yes. I'm in quite a desperate need of that money. We are almost in into uh, the modern age, though. It's taking a while, but we are getting the tourism we need. Hopefully, we get a good freighter soon. What's this? What's this export looking like? Seventeen thousand. And we're oh, really in a recession. A How much is this generating? Not much. Okay, so it... It is unique. You can't stack them on the same houses infinitely. You can't do that. I see. Why is the steel mill not making stuff? Where is your people? Where are your workers? At the bus stop. That's a huge bus stop, by the way. I feel like... Oh my god, $81,000 in debt? Where did I go wrong? Wait a second. I'm gonna go opposite direction on the tenements real quick. I'm sorry, everyone. Recession time. Also, we have a lot of uh, unemployed people because more are coming in than we can build stuff for. So, Tropico first, please. Yes, do that. And then you. Oh, you're at full budget? No wonder. Here, reduce it. Reduce it and try to save. Save? Save the Can we save this before it hits 100,000? Ninety thousand. Gosh, as soon as we can, uh, 
as soon as we can build an airport, I'm building an airport like here or something, and it's going to be gorgeous. No, not $100,000 in debt. I hope that doesn't automatically game over me. It doesn't. It doesn't. I can safely be $100,000 in debt. I don't want to be. Why are my exports so slow? It's income over lifetime, so our lifetime income is $3.12 million. At least from exports. Oh boy. Oh boy. $120,000 in debt? How? What's just not clicking here that's like stopping everything? <laughs> Lifetime export volume, trade routes. Oh goodness. I see, I see. Zero dollars of expected revenue. Did everyone just stop working? Is this a downhill spiral if you reach a certain critical threshold of debt? These people have just been waiting. Has the bus come? There's one bus. Do they ever pick you up? You do get a lot of passengers. And you? Not so many. Alright. Hard recession time. Yep. Hard recession. Sorry about this. can we do here we actually do have a lot of tourism oh boy this is pretty wild I mean this is full does it make money no no it doesn't not really if that's the case we're reducing it yep reducing its budget $190,000 in debt. You're kidding me. I mean, this side is making money. Slowly but surely. I say slowly but surely, but it's made about fifteen dollars to $20,000. You don't pay me enough. I did stop working. You don't pay me enough. I'm sorry, DJ. This has made a lot of money, but good. Okay. Oh, $215,000 in debt. How do I get out of this? Maybe I, maybe I paid the Isla's too? Um...
What else is really expensive? You're all expensive. That's how they stay so green. Your outstock is full? Why are you full? Your outstock is full. Did everyone go on strike from the Teamsters? That emergency job did this. Destination, this. Confirm. Oh my god, we're not exporting. That freighter? Wait. Wait. Your teamsters do go on strike eventually, don't they? I don't see- I see one. I if even that. That freighter made no money. What's happening here? Why are you stopped? I... I want you to to invite you to a multiplayer co-op game, but I don't want you to ruin us. Listen, all I did... All I did... Was... Increase the budget of tenements for a little too long, apparently. Are there any workers here? Yes, you are all over here. Zero storage at the dock. They do go on strike eventually. I see why it's a game over. Scenario. Sign this contract. Yes. Anyway. Export furniture? I would love to do that if my if I can find any teamsters to work. That emergency job. Get this out the door. Confirm. Are you working? What's up with the teamsters man? Your outstock is full, so you're not working. The citizens are demanding elections, Presidente. It seems that we they are want the choice a choice. We are quarter million dollars in debt, so and I still have a 64% approval rating. You know what? Let's do it. Let's acknowledge the issue of healthcare happiness. Praise the faction of the industrialists. Blame no one. I cannot promise anything. My friends, my people. Welcome to a golden age of prosperity for every living Tropican. It was your trust that made it possible. Your trust of me, El President. You know what? What if I loaded the game? So where did this go wrong? This is this just has a treasury of minus thirty-seven thousand. Let's load that. There's a little bit of prog- uh, actually I didn't lose any progress really. If you think about it, as soon as it hit minus 50,000, the Teamsters went on strike and it was just a spiral. If only our Presidente could- could save scum. No wait, I don't want that actually. What? What? What do you mean you don't want it? Alright everyone. Before we hit the recession, before everyone strikes, flop houses, tenements, everything down. 
before we have the election. Before we hit minus 50,000. Okay. Do we still have... Yes, we have the furniture factory here. The steel factory here. It's mostly full on stores. It's just ready to make that steel. Good. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Did I request the financial aid? I did. Oh, okay. What then is so negative? You? Oh yes, you. Then that down. And then you down as well. Good, good. Let's see if we can save it. Gamesters are still working. Someone get that cloth out of the door. Alright, you got some of it. Good. Has this made money? It has not made money. It has a lot of visitors over time. Especially with the increase in tourism. We completed the meat trade route. Look at that. $53,000. We are no longer negative. And you know, this time... <laughs> I mean, other Presidentes aren't as glorious and benevolent as you. Thank you. I will take it. I will take that compliment. And cherish it. Indeed, indeed. Let's export some uranium. Okay, loud uh, motorcycle. And then we can open up another trade route for... You? Logs? I'll take it. Oh, good. Saved? Was that saved? Hmm? I think it was saved. So what we're going to do is use all this uh, saved income, uh, saved expenses from a housing recession we have right now. It's fine. We're producing steel. Wonderful. And when we get, when we get like overwhelmingly positive, when we get that 100k figure, you know, that six figure. We're going to build a couple banks to increase our interest. Because I do believe it can stack. The interest rate diminishes with every additional bank operating on this work mode. Okay. It has actually been po made positive income. Look at that. Isn't that incredible? For the duration we've been positive, it's generated $24,000 of interest. And that's with no workers right now. And uh, bare minimum efficiency. Or budget. Brain cells. I like that. Alright. Now, what's our policy right now? Open doors. We're sending the helicopter to this because it's essential. It's the Teamster's office. Oh, Almanac. Homeless citizens. And they're all poor. Meanwhile, we have some vacant housing. 
We do have some well-off homeless people. So we need to build probably a house. Yeah, I, I think a house for them would be nice. Hydrate and stretch. Thank you so much, Selu. Ah. Ah. Goodness. Okay. Yeah, we're not ready for apartments yet. We haven't increased people's wages enough. I think, honestly, we could, uh, cut out one mansion and have people- have the other families move into, uh, the remaining free mansion. So I think if I demolish this, it will go down two. I destroy one and the other one disappears. Watch. Boop! Oh, they all disappear. Well, isn't that efficient? And we don't have to worry about their upkeep. There's not much housing available. All right. Houses. Indeed. Get those houses in. That'll help with the well-off homeless. And then... The poor homeless. Why are there a bunch of homeless teens here? Unemployed? I mean, we have so many people getting educated. Oh well. It's weird that they ha we have homeless teens there, but we do have social security, so if they go into the school- Oh wait! We probably need another high school for them to be able to get in there. I see, I see. Our high school maxed out. Okay, so if we build another high school and then put those people on social security, they won't be broke, right? Or if we build more jobs, more uneducated jobs. I'm sure it goes both ways. Anyway, childhood museum for $5,000. I could do that. And what else? The trade route? It'll be done. Politics, they're both doing pretty well. What about you? Pretty decently. Would any of these be of interest to you? It's all strictly above board. Export furniture, I happily accept that one. Easy. Okay, set emergency job to get the textiles out of there. Yes, please. And what about the furniture? Okay, same thing. Emergency job. Get the furniture out of here. Thank you. Are we maxing out our Teamsters? We very well may be. Ooh, that's a huge shipment. That might be our biggest shipment yet. 62 thousand dollars and now we have the furniture and cloth in there we're gonna stack that up coal aluminum wow those aluminum mines are already doing it, huh what from here it is a great day for our comrades we even had cake to celebrate there it is communist standing plus five how about that Then...
Oh, we have a tragic network balance issue. I think that uh, maxing out the coal plant and then increasing the budget one tick on the nuclear plant is the most efficient option here. Get the canaries in. And then I want more shit, uh, more mines, please. More aluminum? That easy? Good. And are there, is there anything else to mine up here? I mean, there is these. That's out of the way, though. There's this as well. You know what? Worth it. Let's get a mine town, another mine town set up here. about this way? Does that work? Okay, what if I build the mine a little closer? Yes. Oh, did I hear the pufferfish? Oh, oh. Uh, I can't do that. Oh. All done? Don't, don't, Wonderful. don't, What's don't do that. Who lent After you 250k? No <laughs> Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Nothing happened. You didn't see anything. Hey, we exported furniture. Get that in the Swiss bank account. Now, I don't want to alarm you, but I'm going to need a rather prompt decision on these offers. I'd like a new offer. Yes, please. And then let's increase our trade routes availabilities. We go. I know you so, like the thighs. I know you like the thighs. Thank you so much, Salu. <laughs> All right. Oh. So we do have nickel. We do have planks, but the planks should be going to furniture. We do have gold, but that should be going to. Oh, I shouldn't be picky. We have so much gold. Export it. Fine. And then let's purchase another license for nickel. Yes, that looks good. Ooh, another $55,000 export. Yeah, housing happiness went down. You know what? Instead of having a metro out here, we're going to have another bus stop. Bus garage. All right, starting here. Ending right next to the metro. And you know what? The metro station. Here. Let's uh let's get the metro out here. like all of these okay what if the metro station were like it, it got out right here yes I think that's a good place as good a place as any so 
So that's two spots for the metro station. Not too bad a load on it. And then we'll have we'll try to keep it light. We will have another metro station here to allow transport of people. Uh, both the rich tourists and our citizens to their workplaces. Because remember, I want this to be a rich attraction. But I think that waits for modern times when we can do an airport. We're actually going to increase the budget of the library. Okay. We're about to enter modern times, speaking of. Wow, we struggle so much to have a college education. Is this thing even working? Healthcare is not the issue. You know what? That is perfectly fine because I think hospitals are pretty... I just need to find a place for one. How about here? Yeah, that's a wonderful place for a hospital. I just need to know which way is the front. Which side is the front? I'm gonna assume this is the front. It has a sign on it. Okay, we are rapidly increasing our people here. We have so many homeless people. Some of them are well off. Most of them are poor. If that's the case, here. Residential. House. And then let's have a mansion again. Let's bring the mansion back because we need it. we need another tenement. Cancel that construction, actually. Put it here. Power shortage. Cancel the emergency job. It's fine. You got the cloth out. You should have gotten the furniture out. You did. We have a deficit. Here you go. Yep. Make us positive on that power, please. Can we rebuild this uh, country house? Provide more housing for our well-off. And it's full. What about the tenement? Will it fill up? Yes, instantly. Very good.
We're also about to produce all the steel we need for this deal. The citizens are demanding elections, Presidente. Elections? Well, I have 57% approval. And you better believe I can do a tax cut. So, let's acknowledge the issue of the healthcare. Let's also praise the faction of communists. And not blame anybody. And promise nothing. People of Tropico, it is I. Your Press financial aid, please. You have showed your faith in me. And that faith will be rewarded. Every Tropican will get what they deserve. Your Presidente hears the cries of the sick. You say there are not enough doctors to label all the illnesses. But soon, everyone will know the names of all their diseases. Our efforts are aided by our communist comrades. To each according to their need, from each according to their ability, equality for all especially those who are more equal than others <laughs> i My love that this are made humbly for i am tropical remember a vote for el presidente is a vote for me all right and you what could you be just right here I think, boop, until we uh, think of something. Boop. I'd never there we go. They could be decoration. Before they hatched, but I surely count them afterwards. So thanks for the favor, Presidente. You're welcome. And you know what? I think I'll take plus five industrialist standing. Thank you very much. How's our college education doing? No one's here. You even have a dedicated bus stop. Jeez, children. Nice, the miners did choose this house. I feel like they updated it. They didn't used to efficiently pick the nearest housing uh, for themselves. They used to just choose whatever was open and the population never optimized it, you know? But it seems like over time the population does op now optimize their travel distance between work and home. Especially if given infrastructure for it. I am debating a metro here. Wait, did I already build one? I don't see one. Let's take a look. Uh, metro. Metro. That's right. And then there's a metro here and here. You know what? It might as well be just as fair to give these people a metro station. And that might send us over budget on... No, it won't. Jeez. Presidente, I am oh. inspired. I have solved the problem of capitalism. Oh wait, my shoelace isn't tied. There, fixed. I wouldn't want to trip and fall on my face. What was I saying? No. No, it's gone. Never mind. While I am here, perhaps you could help us with this small task? Ministry of Information. Interesting. I have the money. Let's have a ministry. 
of information, rather. Hmm. We could have another embassy or police station. You did those redeems, right? Yes, I did. Do we need another police station? Crime isn't so bad. I don't know about this side of the island, of the archipelago. Yeah, that gets kind of bad, I guess. We could do something like that. Then, Ministry of Information, yes, please. citizens of Tropico intend to vote for you, Presidente. Oh yeah, they'll vote for me. Even though I broke my promise by uh, going the opposite direction in housing quality. Ah, you opened up some shacks, huh? Well, let's bust down those shacks with a tenement, because I know that your wage can allow you to oh, well off and poor. Well now. We'll see what that does for you. We still have 29. Oh, yep, four. That can fill at least one tenement. How about we open another tenement? Boop. Oh, the jewelry trader is. Scramble and, this channel oh. immediately. The code word is borscht. We have 20 seconds from now. Okay, well, I choose $2,000. Thank you. And then I choose to export 11, at plus 11% bonus revenue. I choose to export cloth. I know the Eastern, uh, the Western Election powers must a love that deal. Presidente. The metaphorical kind, not the kind that accidentally reduces the size of the workforce. Wonderful. <laughs> Residente, Tropico is such a popular tourist destination. We have run out of itchy beach towels and half-chewed tiny cocktail umbrellas. Success! Sweet! The people of the world now know the name Tropico, and many of them have caught a rare tropical disease from our stagnant water pools or semi-purified tap water. We are so famous that Tropico Tummy is in the latest dictionaries as a <laughs> synonym for dysentery. We have arrived. Progress to the modern time. The Cold War is over. The future is now present, and the present will presently pass into the past. Well, we went from uh, 1955 to 1993. Now we balance the pres constant pressure coming from the eight faction. We play the diplomatic game of five superpowers trying to exploit to uh, Tropico and use hackers to fake tourist ratings or tr tweak trade route conditions. The palace declares the Cold War officially over. I still wasn't Tropical born yet, neither was I. Win on points. Total surveillance increases global crime safety by 5, decreases global liberty by 25. Ooh. Security su surveillance. Police stations and, and religious buildings in a theocracy check all residents and workers in their crime safety radius and detect hidden roles with a 5% probability. Decrease the global liberty by 5. 
or privacy rights which increase global liberty by five. Let's do that. Paid healthcare. Clinics and hospitals determine the required economic wealth and service fee individually. Their efficiency is increased by 20%. Single-payer uh, single system. Uh, clinics and hospitals serve citizens of all economic wealth levels and take no fee. Their efficiency is increased by 2%. Hybrid system. Clinics and hospitals serve citizens of all economic wealth levels. Citizens that are poor or broke do not pay the fee, but in turn only receive 75% of healthcare happiness from visiting them. Hmm. I like this hybrid system. Let's take the hybrid system the change. Alright, and now we have the uh, China, Russia, US, Middle East, and Europe relation to deal with. I think that opened up our trade routes. Yes, it did. Let's open up all of them and select what we want. 6% markup on furniture? I'll take it. Yes, please. 6% markup for gold from the US? I'll take it. Hides iron? I could do that. Logs, rum, juice, selfish, shellfish rather, steel? I could do that too. Wool, aluminum. Logs. Uh, hides. Aluminum. Iron. All right, and we still have three available. So we have a decent 6% markup across all of our trade routes now. I can't do any of the others. Wait. That's a lie. I can do steel. So what are our relations after all of that? 49, 49. 76 to the US. 63 to the Middle East. I see. Well, US. How about we put you in the embassy then? And our relation is instantly 81. And then let's actually request financial aid and become even richer. Good, good. And now what we do is government we build another bank. Indeed. And that will generate even greater interest. But for the me uh, in the meantime, I think that's a good place to save. Uh, what was the population when we started? Uh, like 400 something? Now it's 888. And you can expect that to go into the thousands. Uh, on this huge archipelago. I'll try to play more of this tomorrow. We'll see. I may even start streaming early again. Because that was a blast. Really. Alright. So many people. Yeah. It's a lot of people. Don't worry, there will be many, many more. We're going to open up tourism on the other side of the archipelago and get a metro station out there to help. All right, so. Thank you so much for being here, all right?
I hope all of you know that I love you all. It was a wild stream today, actually. Y'all started it off <laughs> with a bang. Pretty literal bang. Like, goodness, thank you so much. Your generosity is not lost on me. Like, it, it was it was crazy, right? Oh, goodness. So, as we always do, we're going to find someone to raid. Should we find a, tropi a Tropico streamer to raid, or should I see if anyone in my circle is on? Thanks for the stream. It was certainly a fun time. It's true, it's true. Would you like to join, uh, join us in a co-op game? Just for fun? Uh, we'll see. Currently, I have been playing games for five and a half hours, and I would like to hang out with uh, some, with, you know, wife and friends and stuff, and, you know, socialize with them a little bit, and then I'll see what's up. That's right. Okay. No worries. Thank you. All right, who's live? I see, I see. You know what? Uh, Madness is actually playing League of Legends. So we're going to show Madness from our very own community some love. And I'm going to raid them. So, raid champ. Madness forever. I'm going to go eat, socialize with wifey and friends. I hope you all have a, wo a wonderful day. <laughs> wonderful evening. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Uh, we'll see what I can do over the weekends, but I will not be streaming by next week. I don't know if that includes Sunday, but there would no be no Monday stream. And then you could block out the rest of the month and maybe and probably next month until I'm back. <laughs> Though, uh, at least in normalcy like this. So enjoy your night. Thank you so much, DJ. You enjoy yours. And I will see you over there, okay? Boop. Oh, right, there's a 10 second timer. This, it's always awkward when I forget the 10 second timer, which is every time. <laughs> 